The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interests at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. This guy's crazy, yo. <laughs> Let me put the laptop down for a minute. <clears throat> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Hey. Back. This thing, man. You're back. Hey. You're back. Welcome back. Hey. Welcome home. It's March. <laughs> I'm back. Mm-hmm. Welcome back. How was your back. How was your week off? Slow so down. Much? My bad. My bad. My bad. Lord. Don't speed me through this, Parks. <laughs> I'm back. You just want to soak it in, Pause? That's it. Okay. That's it for a little bit. I need to look at everybody. Ooh, honey, honey, oh, honey. Oh. honey. This nigga's an idiot. She, <laughs> no, no, no. She, no, it ain't, it ain't she, him she, today. She, it ain't me. It, it ain't, ain't him today. She, I walked she, in come and on. said, I dapped everybody up. I'm like, yo, what's good? What's good? I looked at Mel. I said, what the fuck? You know what? How you doing? And, and ran to the other side of the room. I said the same Smart thing. Man. It must be like sexual harassment on the appetizer list. <laughs> she is trying to serve it up in the workplace. Big man. Yeah, big M4. Flip. Man. You know what I mean? What's up, my man? Ish, ice. Yep. Big parks. Yeah, I wasn't just looking at people, nigga. We missed Listen, you, dog. Um, I mean, it didn't look like it. We did miss well, you. Well, it didn't look like it. The, the well, show yeah, must go on. Yeah, that's true. The show must go on. You but... niggas was laughing, teeth showing, smiling. <laughs> Chemistry was flowing. <laughs> Different interactions here, a little bit of there. It was like, it was like everything I imagined when I hired this bunch. <laughs> <laughs> it was almost like everything that I thought could go right when I hired this particular group of people happened when I was gone. <laughs> I'm going to take that as a compliment. Yeah, yeah. it's a compliment. Now, it's a compliment. I would like for everyone today to remain just as loose, Paulus. <laughs> sure. <laughs> hey, hey, don't tense up. Shoulders relaxed. Everybody breathe. Come on, I want to get in some of that. Getting comfy. I want some of that uh, chemistry fun y'all was having. Why y'all, <laughs> why y'all leave me out of hey, chemistry? Hey, everybody tense up now. Yeah. Shit like, hey, oh, God. Fuck, he's back. Then I heard what you said, Flip. <laughs> I heard what you said. Yeah, I know you did. Said it loud and proud. What'd you say? What'd you say, Flip? Tell him, tell him they called it out. <laughs> nigga said that shit. <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> said when Joe ain't around, everybody look happier. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> he said that? Of course. I don't remember. Yeah. Yeah. We look good. Yeah. Yeah, I, saw, yeah. I saw one I don't of remember them. either. I was having too, too good of a time. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I saw, I saw a tweet from one of the fans. They were like, uh, yo, yo, Joe, big dog, feel free to take a couple pods off. Like, it'll be all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what my audience hit me. <laughs> oh, shit. That's what my audience hit me and said, when y'all started performing good. They love Mel. Oh, she's so amazing when Joe's not there to step all over everything <laughs> and she can get a word out and now she got to complete that sentence. Suck my dick. The fuck is you niggas talking about? What's up? What's up? Yes. Oh, hey, yo, hold on. Um, I know you went to. I'm have, back. I know you went to have interviews, but you came up. No, I went to see my family. You came back up. Yes, you did. But you came back here and you look a couple of pounds lighter. Did you do some surgeries, my nigga? Cause ain't no way you lost that much weight, nigga. You good? I, t- I told you I've been on. I don't that. like. I don't know what you got going on. This nigga got got a sweatshop in his house and you want to lose your weight. I got a problem with that. That's why I was watching you. And then she looked like Xena the Warrior Princess. What the fuck is going on today? A little more Scottish than that. Yeah, a little Scottish. Yeah. For like and, she, and she got, I can't oh, yeah. touch okay. her. And she got the braids. She got the little two Xena that's, braids that's on the side. Scottish shit. Yeah. yeah, she got the Roddy Roddy Piper dress. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I see what you're doing. How you lost all that weight? You, you watched Braveheart this weekend? I, yeah. <laughs> oh, crazy. Yeah, nobody Look, knows. Look, you two scatterbrained. Your jokes is him, her, me. Folk, who you want to crack on first? I don't want to crack on anybody. You? I told you I'm on a weight loss journey. Ozempic. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, I, but I would like to talk about that later. But no, I am. This That's, is. This you, is. No, I, you're shedding diet. some. Diet. You're shedding some pounds, yeah. my nigga. And this, this where is I'm natural. from, I'm to eat less. Where I'm from, there's only a couple of things that help you lose weight that quick. And you don't. Let me look at your. Let me look at your pupils. Take your glasses off. <laughs> Okay, you look at so it's not that. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. All right. So, what's, you the, look, what's the other thing? 
Of Zempic. <laughs> <laughs> now you look, you look, you, you, you. It's look good though. That's my man right there. He does look good. He do. He does green look good. and yeah. pink. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, what made you put that combination together? I like that combo. Green and pink. That's that issue. What was the inspiration behind the green? This and nigga pink? don't run out of colorways, no boy. No, nah? this nigga's like fucking. <laughs> this nigga's like the NHL. <laughs> <laughs> is this there nigga. is there like a customizable option on the site where you can like you know customize Ooh. the the strings, with just, the I hoodie just, choice? I just put uh, two different colors with every order. Oh. Just randomly picked AKA colors. No ice. I'm not ski we. I don't know. I just put the shit on the bed and laid the strings out and it matched. So I rock with it. Mm. When you when did you come up with this colorway, green and pink? This morning. Wait, wait. Wait, you can you fuck? string your own shit? I got strings in every color. So You um, live in a, like a sweatshop? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the so listen for me real quick. <laughs> what you just say, bro? <laughs> You so, said, yo, you a rat. Uh, uh, yo. The mic, the mic picked it up. I know it's cool. So let me ask you a question: Do you tie? A, uh, how do you get the strings through the loop? How do you do that whole shit? Do you have a machine to do it? No, nigga. I had a mother that showed me how to do that when I was a kid. Oh. You tie, you, you clip a safety pin to one end, and then or a paper pull it clip. Through? But I don't got to yeah. do that no more. Oh, but okay. it's a tool that you do it. But so you got the tool. It. I know how to do it by hand. Mm. I don't need it. Who has gotten their one hour house? Seminar. Nobody yet. No. Yo, don't I do waited it. all week to come in and ask you that. Because <laughs> I seen you run around outside. Okay. We seen you. I'm like, and I and I know you was here. You're moving around. You got a family. I'm like, yo, when are people getting they one? <laughs> when are people getting nah, so their one? Basically, I, I'm uh, talking and I land. My I'm dope, about to tell you. But man. I don't I want to crack first. <laughs> don't don't fix it. I'm like, yo, when are people getting they one? And I almost bought one to see. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, talk to me for an hour. I get mine? So then it hit me. A hundred. Yeah, he ain't did one. But then it hit me. This nigga. Is this it. nigga is thinking that he's selling hoodies. He really selling houses. Mm. He only selling hoodies to niggas that can have a conversation <laughs> about houses. <laughs> Oh shit! He is the genius. illest nigga in Nebraska, yo. <laughs> and could don't you laugh, do? Hey, don't laugh at this. Hey, big, hey, hey, big dog. Nebraska, big dog. though. Could you do like this for me? Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! Oh, no. oh my god! Keep popping up okay. new shit, new shit. Hey, yo, man. Oh, Ain't the whole Harlem world on some clue shit. Hey, 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 yo, hey, hey, what yo, the fuck? What is going on? Hey, I yo. promise y'all, we gonna start this pod soon. We gonna start when this pod soon. When you get that? We starting this pod soon. Yo, how you saw it? Ish, can I see? Do like this. What time One more is it, time. Ish? Yeah. Not the brand no, I just want to know, did you, yo, did you have that on ish. when you had the fur? First of all, yes. That's all. Yes. Oh, they got him. All right, everybody in the room. They got him. Throw your rollies in the sky. <laughs> Wave them side to side yeah. and keep your hands hot. Go. You hear your man? Ish. Yo. You hear, nigga, I'm on the. Niggas with Rolex, put your hand I'm on up. the Look, Rolex. Pour hand up. I'm on the Rolex waiting list. This nigga walked right in and walked out with it. Lean <laughs> with it. Lean with it. Let me see. Can, can I see can it? See it I want to see it. For yeah, March, pause. you got Could the you new. Leave me alone, fam. But why did you go and, and kill these niggas like <laughs> that with that. the new that's rolling? A new, that's the new with shit. With the green and pink hoodie with not... the green ones, nigga. Stop. Who the fuck do they think they playing with? And the Don't ro- look at me, nigga. And and the the fuck, nigga who do they think they playing that's with? Up here? And and the watch match match a check on the sneakers, oh, nigga. Oh my god. god. Fuck. Yo, how many hoodies have you sold? I <laughs> can <laughs> stop touching on me. Oh my lord, yo, nah. What did you do on the list? You be lying, nigga. Yeah, he was lying. Right. He was that lying. was just like two days ago. He, he said, I'm on the, the list, list waiting. <laughs> it's a year. You lied. Yo, I'm sorry I couldn't do y'all one hour real estate <laughs> concert. <laughs> I was busy at the Rolex store Yo, and at Richard's that? party Why? turning it up. This guy's a fool. All right, so. we do. We, we got, I guess we got to start at some point. Oh, my God. <laughs> and right after the intro music, I'm right back, bitch. <laughs> I'm right. I'm not leaving I'm this shit.
I'm gonna clock this nigga, yo. You wanna leave your arm in there? Take your arm out. Uh, I should have shot it even with those little pieces. <laughs> <laughs> Flip and Mel, Mel, Mel. Melodies from heaven. Okay, look at y'all. Look at y'all. <laughs> All right, what's up? What is this? 704. Welcome to episode 704 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I'm your humble, gracious, grateful, highly favored. Well rested. So happy to be here. Well rested. You know what I mean? Feeling good, rejuvenated. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> blessed. How was your trip, man? Blessed. Blessed. Just blessed, man. It was a blessed trip? Okay. Really, really, really good trip down south. Mm -hmm. Big Sumter. Nice. They fucking changed the fucking... That little Waffle House rule fucked me up. They ain't letting people in after midnight. Oh, shit. Oh. And oh. something. Nigga, I got... No. Well, yeah. All over oh, Sumter. All, right. no. oh, all okay. over Sumter. Man, I got there at 12.05 looking for a grits bowl. Them niggas are like... Nope. Wow. They know you made pump it up. I don't think so, but I tried <laughs> to pay him. I tried to pay him. Yo, niggas I'm looking go at to a nigga, I'm looking yeah. at a nigga sitting at the counter eating good. I'm like, come on, <laughs> big dog, I pay you. She wouldn't tap the fat white dude in the back. He looked at me. I looked at him. He said, mm, hey, never. Damn. You're never coming in. <laughs> never. Damn. Mm. And then right after he said that, like 20 cars pulled up. I put my on. <laughs> I said, oh, I get it now. But yeah, man, down south was really, really good. That's pergola. Got, got to catch up with the family, seeing all my cousins, seeing my aunt. Ate like a complete oh, fat yeah. ass. <laughs> Went to the family gravesite, brought my girl. That was mushy. That was, that was, that was yeah. How did that go? It's like a thing. With, with her and the family? Yeah. Okay. Great. That's good. That was absolutely, absolutely great. She had a blast. I mean, she said it was just good to see all of those generations. Mm -hmm. I'm sure. You that know. shit is different. Yeah. It's some real mushy up, shit. Man. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it was different for me too. So shout out to uh, shout out to everybody down there. That was great. Uh, and I came back and then I flew to Nashville. Go sit, sit with my girl. Oh, let me not say that. Yeah. Hey, careful. Oh, careful. careful. It was on your ass. <laughs> To sit, sit with uh, Dave was fucking me it up. Was on your ass. I had people cursing me out. <laughs> I wasn't even there. That's what made it funny. Yeah. Yo, how y'all go girl? do that? Y'all did. Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? Why she can't be your girl? He said. Why she got a what? Why she can't be your girl? Because <clears throat> of the public outrage that came. <laughs> that shit gonna go so crazy. On me. Oh my god. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> good interview though. Good time. I mean, I had a good time. I might need to watch the playback after the fans did all that bullshit. <laughs> see what's going on. Did but you I, challenge her? No. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. You're out there looking for a vibe. It's in the four seasons, I ain't out here to challenge nobody. Mm. You know, we had a good time though. We had a good time. That was good. Uh, Y'all will see it. Uh, hopefully it should be done soon. Then got back here. Saw my baby, hung out with him a little bit. Next. Thursday, went to the doctor on them niggas. Come on, healthy as could be. <laughs> fuck, <laughs> fuck they talk about. Hey, clean bill of health. Fuck is fuck, fuck they talk about. Kidney, check. Yep, that. Lift for fuck. They need y'all. Check. All, all, that, that. all that shit. <laughs> it's just <laughs> mad shit on the paper. What Whatever that, that was. I don't know what, what that, that meant. Left of a Vima. Yeah, it was some, some, some other shit. Red blood cell shit. They was going through. Oh, yeah, get the blood work. Yeah, yeah, all of that. Yeah. Come yeah. on, give it to me. Yeah. I'm going to go back, do the full body MRI, do the heart scan. Come on. Mm -hmm. Come on. Come on. Nice. Yeah, no. Nah, yeah, you're, nah, giving, you're giving out. I got it. Insurance next year? No. <laughs> no, not at all. A lot of insurance on that wrist. Oh. Mm. A lot, oh. lot of insurance on that wrist, though, mm. big dog. Your wrist got a whole Talk life about plan. You. Talking about you. <laughs> Your wrist got a life plan. A lot of insurance on that bad boy, right? <laughs> Who you went to the store by yourself? Bruh, what are you talking about? See, oh. <laughs> what store are you talking yeah. about? Yeah. Yeah. Basically, yeah. that is my yeah. big yeah. head. Yeah. What store yeah. are you talking about? That's what he's trying oh to say. Yo, God. God. That is what I'm saying. Yo, enough. I, we, I don't need an ish friend. Enough. Uh, okay. <laughs> enough. Okay. Yo, what for 2024, talking? enough of oh. this. 
Enough of this old ish shit. What does this mean? The humble brag. Yeah, stop. I don't brag don't at all. Oh, okay, not the yes, brag, but like the the, the the false humility. Yeah, they, ooh. Yeah, act ooh. like you, you know you like that shit. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You ain't puning at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. She got you the little shit, too. She hit you with the tutu, nigga. Boy, that shit was a deuce deuce. Pew, pew, he alive still. You better run. I'm mad now. I'm mad. Now. Yeah, yeah, enough for all that. You know what we say, man. Enough for all that. For 2024, Wallen pictures of that party you went to. What party you went to? The Invest Fest tunnel? <laughs> <laughs> that, that was Invest Fest that's ball. That's 80. That's what, the, what was that <laughs> nasty <laughs> shit that I saw? Why is it nasty? That's, that's a little bit of hate. That's hate. A that's lot of it. A lot of it. What y'all think I'm here to do? I, I, yeah, Y'all okay. think I came Welcome here back. to be friendly? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no. Oh, boy. Ish. Yes, sir. You could have knocked out three consultants. <laughs> consultants. <laughs> How long you was outside? <laughs> tell me, tell me about the party, man. Uh, uh, <laughs> tell me about the party. Come on. Yo, what's wrong with your I brain? Seen, yo. I seen you and Ian. Ian, the Ian that that coat was beautiful. Yeah, it's a nice that coat, coat nice was coat. beautiful. Yeah, and yeah, I nice seen coat. your coat too, nigga. It's a really nice coat. That coat looked like Raven was on that motherfucker. My old cat. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened to Raven? Yeah. Damn. That shit looked like some good hyena hair shit. <laughs> that shit, what, what you had on? What is going on with my friends? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about what happened. With the ish hoodie underneath, with the Rolex. <sighs> Yo, what's wrong with Tell you? us about Burn, it, nigga. nigga. What do you want to know? You I went good. to the party. It was a nice. It was actually the. That party's probably one of the best parties I've been to in like the last decade. Yeah, so there we go. That's that shit, what I'm that shit was fire. It was um, the energy was dope. Like it was men coming to other men. Yo, you and this is Richard's 40th birthday party. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yes. It was um, happy birthday, happy Richard. Happy birthday, happy birthday, my nigga. Um, and Troy looked great too. Troy everybody, great. yo, dog. Everybody was nice. The energy in the building was nice. Um, the women was nice. The dudes looked fly. It was it was just a good ass. And you know, keeping the real, it was smelling good. You walking around and the energy is just up. It mm. was like that. Well, no hater shit. Not yeah. nothing. It was black nice. people that was getting money. Niggas was in the exchange. And yo, nigga, I got 150 houses in Detroit. Nigga, what's up? I got. You know what I'm saying? It was literally that lawyers coming up to you, want to poly with you, want to um, do business with you. It was really on some black excellent shit. It was kind of fly. I'm a salute to them. But what about the blacks that wasn't so excellent? Was they coming up to you too? It wasn't none of them. <laughs> yeah, oh, nigga, look, I'm not yeah. jumping on the boat with you. Stun on niggas. Yeah, Stun on niggas. They couldn't even, they they couldn't they, even get they, it, right? They, they couldn't get it. They got locked on my side, huh? Rashad don't want to see y'all niggas while he turned 40. <laughs> You think Rashad of all people? That's all All Star Weekend was missing. Uh, that game. I needed to see Troy and Rashad on the sidelines. I meant to say that afterward, but it's fine. They um they coached. I think the Rising Stars Challenge, or they did something with the Rising Stars Challenge. I needed to see them on the sidelines yeah, for the game. The G League that would have made it perfect for me. They did the G League. Yeah, and Rashad don't want to see no broke niggas at his birthday party. Honestly, I don't even. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> niggas is broke. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yo, who said this shit to yeah. say? Yo, Yo. Bitcoiners! My Bitcoin gang! It's up. <laughs> Fuck is dumb niggas talk? Yo, I talk never sell. No. Never, <laughs> never, <laughs> never, <laughs> never sell. You shouldn't Yo, be. and you been buying. And you I been, never stopped. No, but you, you kept going the whole time. Yes, 250 a week. Oh, yeah, you up, up. 250 a week Bitcoin. Once... Once Bitcoin gang started texting me, because I don't never check that shit. I just buy it and go. I'll be checking it. Man, either. Bitcoin gang started texting me. Man, I'll open that shit like 63, 64,000 Oh, right my now. Lord. Check. I don't know what's happening, but hopefully it continues. Shout out to all the Bitcoin people out there. Salute, salute, salute. Microsoft. Yeah. Microsoft. <laughs> oh. The Microsoft. <laughs> Yo, this nigga portfolio. Yo, your portfolio talking. Nah, those are my two. That's why you got that shirt on. That shirt look nice. That's a nice shirt right there. Nah, that's my two right that's there. That's like 62,000. Oh, my Lord. Mm. Shit was 16 nah. grand in the summer. Shout, to all, shout out to all y'all. But I'm glad that the party was great. Nah, it was fly. Uh, again, happy birthday to Rashard. And... Yeah, great. Where you get that coat from, man? We're going to get back to you later. Where you get that watch from? That's what we want to know. Uh, nice watch. This is, a, this is a nice watch. Did you really have a spot? <laughs> like you said in front of the phone? And if so, so, what block? Come on, Ish. <laughs> <laughs> Too cool. Oh, I thought you was just singing a song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, that's yeah, a fake humble school. shit right yeah. there. That's it. That's what? it. Fake humble? Yes, nigga. You wore the Rolex. What you thought? Niggas just going to sit here and let exactly. you get a yeah, yeah, with a Rolex yeah. on? It's cool. We'll get back to it now. Where yours at? I have an Apple Watch on, sir. Pull out your big QB piece. I'm not from Queensbridge. I know. You from, can I see your chain? 
I don't even have a chain on today, sir. Oh. Mm. Yo, we have an amazing yeah, yeah, show. Yeah, that's we right. have an amazing show lined up for y'all. Today. Who did these bitches think they was playing with? Mm. I have no idea. <laughs> Couldn't be. <yeah. laughs> Who the bitches? Who? All, any them. of them. Them. Oh. Any of them. The field. <laughs> Nigga. Mm. Big man in here. What's up? You said you were going to yeah. announce some shit today, but. Oh, yeah. We're oh. waiting. Oh. Nah. Later? No? Yeah, later. Why? Uh, Why? What's up? Okay. Was, I was anticipating. Come on, okay, tell them, okay, man. Okay, they okay, think okay, you're going okay. to the breakfast club, so come on now. Oh yeah, okay. no, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> maybe, I, maybe I shouldn't have like you know there was shouldn't have done all the whole lead up or anything like that. But um, next Friday is like my last day for like three weeks because I got to go. And I shoot. told y'all the day was. I told y'all. <laughs> I, t- I told y'all. I told y'all out there. I will find a way to get it done respectfully. <laughs> what? Nice, peacefully. <laughs> You're Next so- Friday will be Melissa Ford's last day for three weeks. For- M- yes. Mine- yes. <laughs> yes. No. yes. No, man, no. Don't, don't no. leave me. I'm, 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 I'm getting suspended too. I'm not getting suspended. She's not getting suspended. Oh no. shit, my fault. I, what are you doing? I'm going to film another movie. Hey, let's go. Shout out to Mel. Yeah, because your ass keep popping up in the commercial for uh, Housewife Hunters. Let me tell you something that, I mean, we couldn't, there couldn't have, they couldn't have paid for better press. Like during the Wendy doc, I mean, we had millions That's of eyes. That's all I saw. That shit was Shout so you, fire. Mm-hmm. I was just sitting there. I was so giddy and so excited and so happy. And yeah. Good. Well, you deserve every ounce of it. Thank you. Yeah. Yo, you got Thank killed you. early? I don't die. Oh, okay. <laughs> sequel, yo, don't sequel. Try to, don't yo, try to was, cover up the hate. hate with the clap. That was definitely. Don't try to yo. clap over the hate. Yo, 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 the black person died Yo, your character, you only got a couple lines. You was out, right? mixed. Oh, uh, <laughs> she's mixed. It bought an hour or two. <laughs> God, that's fucked up. Nigga, <laughs> stupid. Um, she's mixed. Where, where, where would everyone like to begin today? We got to start with the beefs, man. I'm with We have to. That That was... The, the topic of everything for the last couple days. Yeah. The beef. Let's go. Yeah. Which beef is first? <sighs> okay. Meek and Act, uh, Rogan versus Shannon, Shannon Sharp. Uh, who else is heating up? Oh, oh, Charlemagne and Act is heating up too. I, I think uh, so. Mandy and Bridget. <laughs> what beef? Oh, shit. <laughs> I, I, I didn't know we had that many. Damn. Come on, man. Stop what? <laughs> I ain't off of that. <laughs> Let that shit go. Never. <laughs> Never that. Sorry. There's nothing to repeat. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she told you, stupid nigga. Let that shit <laughs> Whatever beef y'all want to start oh, with, man. Man. I'm down to start with, man. Oh, man. I was talking about um, the, the Ack and Meek shit. That just has, it's still going, I believe. What are hey, they yeah. beefing over? The Lil Rod lawsuit that mm-hmm. we spoke about. Mm-hmm. Um, the redacted parts of yeah, it were part. that um, there was a Philadelphia rapper involved mm-hmm. in the whole you know situation with Puff. Salacious acts with Salacious Puff. Salacious acts with Puff. So they mentioned an R&B, and sing, an R&B singer, and they also mentioned a rapper from Philly who used to date Nicki Minaj. So... <laughs> I mean, I don't know what the point of redacting his name was, but, you know, <laughs> they left everybody, a yeah, a little bit of, of a breadcrumb. And so. That was a whole loaf. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, it said, it said, uh, rapper from Philly that used to date Nicki Minaj mm-hmm. and R&B, R&B singer who did the Super Bowl. Yeah. <laughs> the shit might have said who just did the Super Bowl. <laughs> it said recently. Or so my first question to y'all before we continue to unpack this is, why does Meek Mill get all of this coverage and Usher does not smooth could they like Usher not even that I feel like it's because Usher hasn't said anything yeah Usher stayed quiet yeah. Meek didn't say nothing until they jumped on his ass mm. pause who's that the, the, the comment all of that shit mm-hmm. no they ignored the Usher part because they like Usher I tell y'all all the time when they like you they don't care what you do Meek ain't really liked in the public so what they look for an opportunity to jump on me do you think that it's a it's more of a like situation or if it's mo- or it's more of a R&B and rap situation it's a like situation because if it was it's because, a little both. No, be because, no because if there was another R&B singer listed and it wasn't Usher that they don't like they would have jumped on his ass immediately I like, think it would depend on who the R&B I'm not saying any was. names but there are R&B singers that if something pops out with their name on it they can't wait to jump on their ass if it was Trey, no, if it was on, Trey or Chris they would have jumped on it's only Chris and Trey yeah. those are R&B singers no 
Yeah, yeah. But, yeah I'm but just it's all, it's all, I'm solely speaking on the law. Yo, did you what you, <laughs> you did? You, did you, you good? <laughs> <laughs> <Did you let? laughs> well, no, I'm just speaking on the fact that if they don't like you, if they were not in the best eye of the public, since something happened, they they pile on you. I think it's a class thing too. Like Usher's in a different class, yo. Like Usher has garnered a certain level of stardom, respect, and respect, and yeah. cachet. I think. Mm -hmm. Fam, they like um, Usher. I'm, if it was R. Kelly name in there, what would have happened? It would have been a nigga. Uh, everybody would have been like, and. and he done garnered all that shit. Nah, what that's not true. About? Dog, even when the R. Kelly shit, look how long it took for them to really. I'm talking about today. If it said R. Kelly in there and not Usher, if the, the hints were at R. Kelly, what would the public reaction be to it? They would have been on R. Kelly's ass. They just like Usher. He's a darling. So they turned a blind eye to Usher. Especially coming off the Super Bowl where everybody love you. I don't want to be the guy that, that never believes men when they start talking about their sexual abuse. But. This nigga lying. This nigga lying. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about it, like, nigga. Do I, I don't make me say it. Mm -mm. I, I mean, it. I think they just said it for you. I said it last week. Yeah, I said they didn't want me to say it. I agree mm -hmm. with them niggas. Like, <laughs> <laughs> this, this, and it's just. Uh, <laughs> this is my thing. Aside from the pictures he posted that was the porn star dude, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this is the same dude that a couple months ago popped up saying, hey, you jerked me on my pub. Where's my pub? I did this record. I did that record. And nobody ever paid me. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm not a genius. But if he got <laughs> sexually abused, I would assume that would take the precedent. Start, start there, yeah. Over pub publishing. My publishing. Yeah, yeah. I was down south, like, yo, what is going on now? <laughs> Bro, bigger yo, bigger yo, than you, that, go ahead. the first time you get quote unquote sexually mishandled, mm -hmm. I'm sorry, dog. My, you got to engineer your own shit. Yeah, I'm out of here. I don't want to be I'm going to continue yeah, yeah, working. Yeah. What are we talking about? Mm. So I looked at some of the stuff that was in that report, like the Meek and the Usher shit, the same way as Takashi on the stand. Just, they was asking him about shit that didn't have nothing to do with shoddy or nothing. He was up there talking about, yeah, I hung out with Cardi B one night. Yeah, I was over here <laughs> with me and Lotto. <laughs> like, like, that's how you just, it yeah, just like, seemed like he was throwing shit in there mm -hmm. for it to be salacious. I think he was doing that shit for public fodder. Yes. And he, in hopes that they're going to settle. He want to get paid. Up. Yeah. Hey, if it's so, not going to be from the publishing, it's going to be from Accusations, something. yeah. Even before that. He got a GoFundMe up trying to raise fifty thousand dollars so he could sue Puff. Uh, and what was that? Sixteen hundred. It was now? that like fifteen hundred. Like, like fifteen, sixteen hundred dollars. That was like as as a man, this week, I think that's earlier this month. Oh, okay. February fifth is when that went up. As a man, mm -hmm. I think that's disgusting. Now I don't want any of what I'm saying to negate this fact about Puff. You might get it confused with our take on this particular part. But the truth of the matter is just, hey. <laughs> Once them drums come on, you better run, nigga. You better get out of there. Wait a minute! Hey! They too young out there. They too young out there. Puff is a wild boy, man. Yeah. I mean, that's all I got. That much is clear. That's all I got. These yeah, like, don't think just because we think this nigga lying. Yeah, but he, yeah, he's still wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, be very clear. Freak ass boy. <laughs> <laughs> niggas is nasty, man. Yo, niggas, niggas is, is just crazy. freaky out That's here, it. man. That's it. Niggas is just freaky, man. It's, it's so crazy for a nigga to jump on a bandwagon in order to get paid. These niggas, man, go outside and sell a brick like them niggas be saying to me on Instagram, nigga. Go sell a brick. <laughs> Go outside to sell some ass or something, nigga. That's what they tell That's you. What they, yeah. Some people play around. But it's not about me. Go do that, <laughs> you bitch ass nigga. Piling on Puff, and, and if like like we said, if he's guilty, nigga, we not we not we not condoning. taking away from anything or condoning right. what he did. But you are lying, nigga. That's it. Nigga trying to make gumbo out of a lawsuit, nigga, throwing this in there, this in there, this in there. We don't give a fuck, nigga. You're lying. We can tell. And it's nasty as a man to do so. I agree. And if you, you're not getting paid. That shit nasty. Period. Take your GoFundMe now or cash out for the 1600 nigga. Just go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Count your losses. <laughs> Disgusting. Little Rod. I Rodney. Sorry. No, fault. go ahead. I don't think Meek is gay or bi, mm. but mm. I also don't care <laughs> if he's gay or bi. 
but it certainly was just funny to watch him reply all day to he like that the shit. claims. But how, one that, how did he and Act start shooting at each other? Because Act highlighted. Act is the one that highlighted uh, the redacted part of the uh, uh, the case. Got you. Okay. So then he went on stream and he and he, and he spoke about it. And then Meek saw it and replied, and then they just replied for two days. Still going. Mm-hmm. Still. Yeah, they're still going. And then Meek called the governor, right? Did we say that no, already? No, the, gov- the governor called I mean, Meek. the governor called Meek. And Meek ratted on Act. Did we say that? No, we didn't say that. Like, we've been laughing at this for a little while. No, we didn't say that. Yeah, and then he, he snitched on Act and said, hey, this guy's responsible for the black death in my community and so many of my friends losing their life. And then Act said, you a snitch. <laughs> Come see me. I'm going to beat you the fuck up. I don't think you can fight. And then Meek was like, soon as I get off this road, I'm at your podcast circling the block. Pissing on the steps, all yeah, types of yeah. shit. <laughs> and then Axe said, nigga, you willing to crash out over this? And then Meek said, I'm willing to die about this. <laughs> you got to remember, listen, I know people don't like when we say this, Joe, where we from. I know society has become more acceptable to people's lifestyle and, and pe- the way people live, just who they are. Mm-hmm. Sure. Mm-hmm. In the neighborhoods of the hoods, some of the stuff is still taboo, right? If you come from the hood and you go and you frequent the hood and niggas find out you like balls hitting your chin, mm. we're going to look at you a little bit that different. That was descriptive. Shout out to our gay listeners out so there. Look, my fault. We appeal to all we right do, here we do, JB. We do. We do. <laughs> Sorry. I'm just saying, so I understand Meek's frustration. I understand the frustration, Joe. It's wrong. And I'm with you so far. That, that's how you get at a nigga who's from outside, who made it, is put some gay shit on him when yeah. he's not gay. Yeah. They, they go, me, you gonna crash for me, out. For me to be a street rapper, for me to, you know, talk the shit he talks from Philly, family be big on jail reform and all that, I could see how that being on yes. his jacket is muddy, so he got to clear that up. But here, just here, here, my, my Niggas will crash out, I, I No, I'm agreeing with niggas you. Niggas will crash out for that. He's not, my thing he's is, not doing the greatest job of... Act didn't put that on you. Act highlighted it though. No, it was uh, highlighted. It was already highlighted. Yeah. Everybody no, was talking no, about it. No, that's, 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 that's not true. That's, that's, that's not true. 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 That shit was on. Y'all do not know that that is the only rapper from Philly that Nicki Minaj has dated. Nobody knows that. Act don't either. I know. So for him to put that on Meek, I'm just nigga. Everybody read it. It's on the same page. It ain't like you had to go think about it. It had that redacted part, and right there at the bottom on the same page, it had the. "Quote unquote," the, the footnotes. Too. We can't. We can't take away. But our the powerful. paper don't say meek. No, because it cannot say meek. Correct. Yes. So you could do all the inferring that you want to do. Mm-hmm. That which paper, everyone did, which is fine for everyone. But meek is saying this nigga is a voice in our culture. Yeah, there you go. I so get that. for him to now just be irresponsible and report, I'm on some gay shit mm-hmm. is foul. And I did understand that. I get that. The part. rest of the the rest of the people could say, Hey, they talking about meek. They could do that, but the the people that are, are strong right. and prominent Sorry. voices and we 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 some of us are held to a different standard, and they hold act to that standard. His voice is powerful. It is. So when you Very say powerful. something like that, you know, and then don't skip the usher line right underneath, nigga. If you are gonna do it, that was do my it. So, but again, and that's the highlight of the Meek shit. That's him highlighting Meek. I just want to say, if me and Meek came out at the same time, I think he would be beating me in terms of memes and internet viral embarrassing clips. Yeah. I just got like a nine-year head start on him. <laughs> but if we started at the same place, dog, the, the, the and there's some of the shit you got to answer. The Mike Rubin bunny hop and shit is funny. Like, they're going to always go to that. The French fries on the legs. Funny. That's funny. funny. They're going to always go to that. You falling down the steps. Nigga, I was, that was the last blizzard we had. <laughs> I remember that. That's funny. On your grandma's steps. Oh, my God. <laughs> you with the punching bag. That's, That's funny. funny. He just got too many of them. Oh, but that, they, went, they went a little crazier than just those. Oh, yeah. They went to the black porn site. They went to that. In they his went, follows. They right? went to him and Puff with the matching shirts. Mm. At the party, they did. See, I thought that I thought that was unfair. I'm just saying. I thought but that what, but when the floodgates is open, that's what they're gonna they're gonna yeah. go for everything. Y'all know Puff been trying. Oh, and that sound like I'm defending. Y'all know that nigga be trying to match with niggas. Since more money, more problems. He be trying to match with niggas. That's his thing. 
I seen that picture of him and Meek. I was like, when they did a record? <laughs> what the fuck? Y'all ain't got no reason. They, 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 matchy, matchy. they went and got the old Drink Champs clip. That was good. up there with Nori and um, Kiss and Fab. Fab. Like, yeah. It, yeah it, it, oh, my mm. God. That, yeah, that was crazy. That one. <laughs> then there was another one of Puff calling him daddy. Mm. Meek was in the pool. Puff. Yeah, like they they gonna start digging now when that once the gates is open. Oh, and then they pulled up uh, Meek at I think that was a Lenny S party in LA, Any freestyling over never too much. Oh yeah. With Puff next to him, looking at him a certain way, man. I don't like this shit. I went looked at the track, listened to the new EP, and was like, uh, some of these titles might be might not be the best. I tell you what, though, time, I tell you what though, it's some shit on that shit. Say what you want about him. This is hot. Say what you want about him. Shit on that. I ran right to listen. It's I like, fuck all it. that noise. He dropped that a day early. Mm. Yeah, my Thursday. I like that. Yo, can we change the time? Can we change the time on Thursday that these projects drop? Please. That felt so great in, in the in, afternoon. Independent. Yeah, but that mm -hmm. felt they good. can't do that. He would no push the button now. Man, go in the corner office of the major label and tell him you want to drop at twelve in the afternoon. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, yeah, okay. You get a head start. So much is better about that. Yeah, you know, fun. me and Parks really wanted to go back to Tuesday drops. Tons. Yeah, for real, for real. I love Tuesday drops. Where you could actually you sit with his project. Yeah. I hate having to come in here and talk about something that I heard one like, and a half times in the shower. That's why I'd be happy like, to get a project early. At least I get some time. Like, the projects yeah. dropping on Friday stopped, have stopped the DJs from playing the new songs the week it drops. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They don't even you know them You don't know slap yet. They yeah. don't know them You don't songs. know it yet. Ooh, mm -hmm. that track three on, on Schoolboy, though. I think it's track three. Um, what, whatever the, that the, 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 shit. Got, got. Uh, Ooh, don't yeah, worry. We're going to get to it. Yeah, we're going to get yeah. to it. Uh, That's the one. What was we saying about me? Yeah, they just, they, oh. it was just. But fuck all that. Meek's EP did drop. It did. Yes. Mm -hmm. the, title, the title kind of. What's the title? For people who might not know. Heathenism. Oh. Huh. I like it. Yeah. Well, yeah. Just strange with the timing. Yeah. 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 What, what's the time? What, what, and then it starts true? off with came from the bottom. Oh, shit. Why, y'all niggas is so salacious in your minds, man. I'm sorry. What you the fuck? Niggas, what time is bad? What's wrong with you, Parks? Sorry, No, he didn't. <laughs> and the EP is hard. Yeah. That's all that mattered to me. I don't give a fuck about none of that other shit. <laughs> Big boy. <laughs> Big boy is hard. It's hard. It's hard. <laughs> Oh, Parks want to play. Yeah, he's not. <laughs> it's just bad timing. Listen, it's hard. It's hard. It's, it's hard. some joints. And them ain't even the hardest ones on there. It's yeah, hard. no, that's just a one and two. A nice five pack. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this was a really good five pack. Nice five me. pack, meat. Yeah, bravo. Yeah. Bravo? Bravo. And again, really? I'm champion all the independent shit. I like it. I like people realizing that, hey, I could do this maybe on my own. I might not sell the most, but my business will work out better for me in the long run. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm all for that. So salute. The big boy is the one off of this project though. That's yeah, the, I was about to one. I was about to play that's that now. To go to? That's big, Fabio, right? No. No. Wait, no? It's Big Boy. That's what I and, oh, no, no, no. And the record it's after with, Fabio. Uh, and the record with Future, giving Chanel. Oh my Ooh. God. Oh, Future went crazy. I would play all of these songs. Yeah, I, it's a nice <laughs> I fuck with them. <laughs> yeah. But we're potting. So yeah, yeah. we can't. But shout out, shout out to me. I was so glad to be uh, around family and like looking at grass on a golf cart. That grass is nice. Eating fucking simple shit. The sim yeah, the down yeah, but life. but all of that. I when all of that chaos was going on on the internet, and boy, it was a lot of it. I was just glad that I was nowhere in sight. I was glad that in my real life, I was able to be busy, occupied, family, love. Did you find it easier warmth, to like keep to put your phone down? All of the good shit. Not pay attention well, I don't have a problem putting my phone down, but yeah. yes, my okay. phone was down. By the time I picked it up, it was, oh, look at all this going on. But I just wanted to come in and tell you niggas, it's okay to put that fucking phone down for a little bit. It is. The, word, the, word, the, word is. Is, the word is disconnect. Like you said, you were disconnected from all the bullshit, so you didn't see it. It didn't affect you. You even That's process that feeling. shit differently when you're not engulfed. Facts. Mm -hmm. When I'm upset with my family, I don't even really well, think about my shit. And then that? when I look at it, it's like, oh, oh I miss this. Oh, okay, cool. That's interesting Damn. anyway. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> all right. Yeah, man. I want to encourage you niggas out there to not, I think touch grass is overused, but appropriate. But I think that I think that is different because you you guys came from 
being off the internet. You started off the internet. You remember what it was like being outside and hand in hand and being with people. Some of these people started Grew up with the internet. Yeah. Yeah. That's why they need niggas like us to come in here and say, go meet a fucking friend. No, real shit. Go meet somebody in real life. Yep. Talk That's to cool. Talk to them. Or, hey, go to your, hold on for a minute. Sorry. Go to your favorite restaurant. Find a favorite restaurant, a, a hobby, a game, a place you like to walk, some shit you like to do with just you and off the phone, nigga. Mm-hmm. I feel right. bad for those people. Bro, they don't He's know right. how to do that, Joe. Like, even going to, like you said, a restaurant, a hobby or something, if they can't capture that and put it on social media, it, didn't it don't even exist. Yeah, yeah. I, think, I think the internet doesn't even allow them uh, the internet has desensitized what's the word I'm looking for desensitized, desensitized. desensitized yeah. people that they don't know how to approach anybody in public yeah. they don't True. know how to have conversations like when I was growing up I could go outside and go to a park and meet somebody playing basketball or baseball and shit like that and now y'all niggas is cool you can't hey, I see hide behind putting LOL at the end exactly. of your sentence in real life <laughs> exactly <laughs> you know what I'm saying yeah, yeah, but like, they need to they learn. don't know how to do that shit nigga they, they, they think the internet is mean? how how would they learn man go to a bar in Lower East Side Fact. and just sit there yeah. go yeah. to Astoria and take a walk Word. I promise you you will not get seven blocks before you've met somebody new Facts. he's right mm-hmm. he's right it's not really I, encouraged I I, yeah, yo, uh, that's what I mean when I, I say how. They don't even know. No, nope. I had a conversation uh, yesterday. The dude was thirty-one. He mm-hmm. said, "Yo, I don't talk to girls on the phone." I said, "What?" Mm-hmm. He was dead ass serious. He said he don't talk to girls on the phone. I'm like, "Yo, how you get to know him? How you get to like him? I'm like, I don't understand. They don't know how. I don't understand text. that. Yeah, I can't like you over a text. I mean, I can't that. start to develop a like for you via text. I can't." I'm with you. I can't. You from a You stupid niggas don't even do the fucking uh you get your your crew and I'll get mine. True. Nobody has Nigga, they, they they died. a real Nigga, crew. Nigga, they crew online. Nigga, mm-hmm. go, they ain't got no fucking crew. They, they don't want to leave the house. They main man in, the, in Minnesota. Word. How the mm-hmm. fuck you gonna get you don't even know what he look like? Gotcha. <laughs> That's crazy, son. Yeah, you get your crew and I get my crew and we're gonna meet up in the Twitter space. Oh, uh, breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. Uh, y'all don't, it's, it's all shit that y'all don't care about. Okay. But I'm here for the tea and the mess. So, this past week, Dream Doll, they've been all in oh, Dream Doll's that. business. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, she posted, so. You uh, know. But they was in her business a little bit before that. Okay. Dream Doll, Jersey Dream Doll. Mm-hmm. Okay. The rapper. Anyway, okay. anyway, Dream Doll, allegedly, her man is like some type of scammer. Well, he, first, he was a so- he's a soccer player. He's a soccer player scammer. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Score! And I guess he... Ole. Goal! And I, guess, and I guess... And y'all can Google it for yourself, because I'm fucking the facts up. But he's a soccer player scammer, and they was looking for him. And then Dream Doll posted a picture of him in Dubai two days ago. And guess who they just got? Him. In, in Dubai. Oh, so his name man. is Quincy Promes, I want to say, or Prom- P-R-O-M-E-S. Big male. Yeah. I was looking at this because I saw all that stuff. Um, and he's like a Dutch professional footballer. Yeah, footballer. And also That's a right. convicted criminal. That's what his Wikipedia literally oh, says. Shit. So somebody just Quincy Promes that. detained in Dubai on a separate charge amid six-year prison sentence for drug trafficking. Mm-hmm. Yeesh. There. That's my tea report for the day. <laughs> Moving right along. Oh, also the fact that he appears. <laughs> also bye the bye. fact he appears to be married with three children. So there's also that. That's it. Okay, that's it. That's yeah, it. We don't care that's about a little that. Bit yeah, that's it. it's fine. Okay. He had on the boat and shit. It was her birthday. Let her. Let them enjoy that. I mean, I was just reporting. <laughs> okay. <man. laughs> All right. What what other fights we got? You told me some other ones. What up, what other fights we got? Run on your list, man. You told me a bunch of fights. I, uh, I know about this one. Did you get me the Bridget Mandy tea from the party? <laughs> there was there was no Bridget Mandy tea at the party. Mandy was there. Mandy was there. There wasn't no tea. You saw your video with her. I had a video with Mandy. She put a video up with you. Yeah, my favorite guy. So that was it. I was hating on you. Why? Because I don't like that shit. Why you didn't come? Oh, you were outside. You didn't invite me. You didn't give me a coat. I asked you to borrow a jacket. I, I, actually, <laughs> I, 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 I snitch on him. I asked you to borrow a jacket. You said you wasn't going. Exactly. That's not no, he true. Said, no, he said no, he, he was said going. He said he was going. Corey said he wasn't going. Mel. I didn't say I wasn't going. I called Ice and asked Ice if Ice wanted to go. He did say he was and going. And I also said, yo, I got a coat for you and everything. You oh, can you come get, to the spot. Oh, so Ice didn't wow. want to go. Wow. Wait, 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 so wait. So Flip asked wait, for a coat and you said no. Thank you, Mel. Flip never asked me for a coat. What type of fucking disrespect was that? 
I got a coat for you and everything. Coat, <laughs> Who the fuck you think you talking to? <laughs> Put some speck on my name. You gonna let him gas you? No, I said that before he said a word. I don't. Oh, I, I got a coat, nigga. I was. Damn, I, I got a coat for you. <laughs> you know what I'm I got a coat for Yo, you. Yo, I got a coat for you. It's I wasn't, not I got a coat. I wasn't Yo, trying so to that's be immature. disrespectful to my man. Yeah, that's immature, immature for you. But why, nigga, why would you say that? He wanted y'all to match, the Robbie. The, no, the theme, he's his son. the theme of the party yeah, was, was animal and print prints. and fur. Oh, so yeah. just in case Ice didn't have a coat, but he has a fur coat. Oh, I didn't. Pardon me. No disrespect. I didn't have fur coats before you, nigga. Before who? Oh, no, he's 50. He's 50. Slow down now, Pimp. Slow down. Yo, but I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all right. But uh, I got carried away. Yeah. No, what I was saying was I wasn't trying to disrespect Ice. I'm just saying disrespect. if that was one of the things that you didn't want to go because of You got a coat. I got you, you my man. All right, I nigga, you. I asked for I asked to hold a coat. Why you left it? Yeah. Flip never asked me for nothing. Flip's lying for the pod. But anyway. Would you give it to him? Yeah. Well, wait, the coat that could fit me could fit Flip? <laughs> I got oh, a shit, couple. That was, you wouldn't let me hold a coat? That was shady. Nigga? I don't think so. <laughs> Nigga, stop playing. A, a, yeah, you a fur? fur? You wouldn't let your man hold a fur, nigga? What kind no. of fur? Let him hold a long joint, too. I, I, I would let you yeah. hold a coat. No, he got, he got, no, the one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, no. I would yes, never do that. Yes, you would. That's the a long boy. joint. I'm going to get the white joint that you got. I'm, no, I'm, I don't get the white I'm, one? I'm going to get the white joint. You got white fur? Yeah, you got the white fur here and pick up. Yeah, I'm going to go take it. This nigga memories. <laughs> yeah. no, you didn't say that. You didn't say that. Yeah, I'm going to go take that you shit. Get what, you're crazy as hell. Nigga, you know where we from, nigga. Furs, nigga? Joe, stop, Joe. Niggas gave you jackets off their back before. Stop it, nigga. Not thirty, not thirty thousand dollars jackets though. It don't matter. Yeah, niggas had half my publishing too. I don't, oh. give, a, I don't give a fuck about them jackets. <laughs> I bought them jackets, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> jackets. I bought that coat. <laughs> jackets can suck my dick. <laughs> right. You, you got Yo, me. Oh, that's fucked up. That is I bought funny, them son. jackets. That's nasty. Oh, oh shit. shit. Yo. Oh man. I bought that fucking stupid ass chinchilla, and it never snowed again. Nope. Oh. It never did. Mm -hmm. Never got cold. I wore that shit twice. And one of the times I reached for it. You did. On TV. You did. Yeah. You did. I let fucking Ian talk me into that shit. <laughs> Ian told you that? He talked me into it. Damn, I'm, that's shocking. Would you wear it again? Mm -hmm. Well, no, I had it on. Oh, you mean the wear it? I wore it. Okay, okay. And he, said, Keep and it he was like, keep it on. I thought Ian told you to buy and it. I was I'm like, like uh, here? Like, yeah, fuck it. So they got and that's all Lucas. somebody got to say to me is fuck it. <laughs> if somebody's telling me fuck it, I'm down to do whatever the plan is. <laughs> Yo. Yo. <laughs> We need a couple more dollars. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> you got it. Uh-oh. You got it. You got me a bracelet? Stop, don't play. Oh, I thought it was just... No. Uh -oh. He still ain't giving us our gifts. Oh. Still ain't giving us our gifts. Oh, <laughs> one, one less watch. Hey, sir. Hey, sir. <laughs> he, did all, he did all that freestyle and made him hey, feel sir. good, nigga. Well, all the time, fuck it don't work. <laughs> uh, oh. all, Come the time, it. all the time, fuck it don't work. I forgot how old I was. My man came up with this plan to hit the lower, lower, lower banks. Like the bum banks that just be in mm -hmm. the corner. Little community bank shit, the little shit. Yeah, yeah, had it mapped out. <laughs> All them bum, give me a little bank. I said, what do you want to do? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want me to do? Nah, <laughs> I ain't doing that. Nah, fu no nah, fuck it. Nah, 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 no, 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 fuck it. Not at all. No, fuck no, it. no, 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 fuck that. Uh -uh. Yeah. <laughs> fuck you, fuck you, <laughs> fuck you. It wasn't a bad little plan. But yeah, yeah, no. yeah, yes it was. Yes it was. I didn't do it. I was did rapping. He, I started did rapping. He, did he do it? <laughs> Did he get away with it? Yeah, that's what I want. Yeah, no, he went away. Oh, yeah, okay. went, it was a bad way. No more focus. <laughs> he got away with it, but he didn't get away with yeah, it. He, he went away for a little bit. No focus. Uh, who, who else is beefing? Ack and Charlemagne are beefing, but I don't want to be the one to blow it up. <laughs> They're doing the quiet beef? But they beefing. Like passive aggressive beef? Yes. Okay. And it always stops because Ack says, no, nah, he's not talking about me. And that's the end. But he's definitely talking about you. I think it's hard to beef with somebody that you look up to. And it is. Oh, I don't. And act, act looks up to Charlemagne and respects him, so it's hard. Sometimes you got to just take the shots of somebody you, from somebody you respect. He talks about Charlemagne with a different type of reverence. He does. He talks about the both of y'all with, with a certain type of reverence. And um, I think you still want to keep the relationship possibilities open. Mm -hmm. You know, when act go, he go. Like, mm -hmm. he just mm -hmm. go. And I don't think he is prepared to do that with Charlemagne. Because he loves him, because he loves him, and he reveres him, so he'll just be like, "Why did like I give, give him more grace? Why? What's Sorry. it about? Yeah, how about that? Well, I don't. Know. Well, my answer is I don't know. Okay, but from what I've been seeing, Ack went on a rant about uh, 
the people that have been so pro-Democrat in the last four years. Because now that Trump got a sneaker pop in, now that Trump is moving around, uh, 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 Ack is saying, don't y'all try to now be open-minded and say, oh, I could see Trump winning. Mm-hmm. You, Charlamagne, Angela Rye, whatever whatever uh, Ack was saying. I I think that Charlamagne heard that. Because very, the very next uh, week, he starts saying, Yo, my sons my are son. angry. My son. Daddy may have been neglecting you. Mm. But if you just see my sons acting out, <laughs> just go in the comments and say, Daddy's not coming home. Damn. Mm. And Ack is the only person that has been asking Charlemagne to come on his podcast that he hasn't done. Ooh. Okay. okay. Got it. Hate to Got come it. in here and be messy, man. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> that's your favorite shit in the world. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's mess I normally don't touch. Oh, okay. that's true. I normally don't say that, but it's it's too right in my face. You niggas are bugging out. Uh, who else? He won't give us the Brandy Midget, uh, Brandy, uh, Mandy, <laughs> Mandy <laughs> Bridget. Too. He won't give it to us. Holding it tight to the vest. I don't know. Tight to the vest. Tight to the vest. And I think I know why, but that's what they'll be our little do, secret. Do, but do you have any speculation to why? No. Okay. I don't. I haven't spoken to either one of them. I'm just saying, but do you, if you can assume as being um, a veteran in this business. I could assume, but it's juicier than whatever I could assume, so I want the truth. <laughs> <laughs> I want the truth. Yes, I also think, hey, call me crazy, y'all have done it before, that Shannon Sharp and Joe Rogan got something. Well, I think Joe Rogan got something going on with Shannon Sharp. I, like it's in, in terms of a beef? I, what you not mean? a beef. Competition. They, Com- yeah. Healthy competition. Yeah. I don't think that Joe Rogan liked that 50 million views that uh, mm-hmm. Shannon got, got with Cat. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because he had to be quiet for a long time. This is his first foray back into YouTube. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So he had, to, he had to be low. He's back. And I'm happy he's back. Me too. I'm happy he's back. Uh, Cat Williams did Joe Rogan. That was the first interview back on, on YouTube. I can't mm-hmm. wait to finish mm-hmm. it. I just miss seeing that type of shit Me too. on YouTube. There was a void. Yeah. He had, I mean, they, had, they would put clips up and shit like that, but it's not the same. It's yeah. not the same. And that shit is doing is doing is doing numbers. I, I was enjoying. They were just in there, aliens, yeah. smoking weed, yeah, yeah, yeah. conspiracy theory shit, tinfoil hat bag. I'm into it. Yeah, I love it too. I, 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 did, I was I started it like midnight, and I was tight. Like I three finished. hours long, so I was like, damn, I gotta go to bed. I don't want I don't want to stop this. Shit, That's though. my plan for for this evening. Oh yeah, same. I'm finishing that. When did it drop? Mm. Yesterday. Yesterday. Yesterday? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. What's Pause. The- let's find the menthol clip. I got the menthol clip, but is you kind of sky do I? <laughs> Throw him another one Make him reach up yeah, for yeah, it Yeah you gotta, you gotta. <laughs> That's how you did it on him You did it on him bam, You bam, did it on him bam, bam, Did it on him bam. That's crazy So you gotta Ready Are you ready Are, are you ready, ready? What's, What's going, going on? on We can't go to dinner Honestly We can't eat Sure we got to walk up in Brooklyn Chop House with the furs on. No, we don't. We got to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where did I go recently? I went somewhere, and I, it reminded me of you, because I cleared the left side alone. <laughs> Why you remind me of you? I cleared wherever <laughs> I was at. Your man, your man, I was just sitting on the left side of the bar. You had that shirt on? You had that sweatsuit on? No. Oh, no, yeah, he had that shit on, though. You good to do that. I don't remember what hey, you look. You look. No, I said no. like sweats. You, like you get a lot of home. money. So you, you look rich. That's a rich sweat. Yes. You like one of them. No, you like that. Did you have that shit on? No, I, this is my first time wearing this chain. I only wore this chain today because the niggas thought they robbed me of the chain and the bracelet. See, that's <laughs> nigga shit. You know that's nigga they, shit. They thought right? I had the chain and the bracelet no more. What they nigga? seen the ring and was like, I ain't seen the chain and bracelet. I'm like, all right, now. That's nigga <laughs> shit. <laughs> now what? You showed them the watch. Yeah, they, like they, they, like they, they thought I did a trade in. You know what I mean? Had to come in and show what's going on. You had to see me the Candace. She was like, so. <laughs> <laughs> Black, the gun policy <laughs> in America. Yo, you were looking like, what's his name? Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock. Inspector Clouseau. Inspector Gadget. Nah, them, them <laughs> niggas called me fucking uh, bisexual construction, sh- construction paper. <laughs> Yo, nah, they called me bisexual construction paper. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dead ass, that's what they called me. <laughs> Which is almost worse than Freak Mill. 
They lit me. They lit up. you up. I saw a couple of things. You look like a foldable napkin in a fucking in fine dining <laughs> restaurant. They didn't say that. You just made that up. Work. I, I saw that, that shit. shit. I saw it. that, man. You look clean. <laughs> look at that shit. I, I, I like that outfit. Bro. Yeah, I liked that outfit. I like opulent. Mm-hmm. I mean, I like the thing. I ain't care for the shoes, but I loved the outfit. The outfit was fine. We talk about the watch. Hmm? Right. Yeah, you change that subject quick, I like boy. <laughs> I like that outfit. I saw Thank him in the hallway. I said, yo, that's a nice, you know what I mean? Right here, this one right here. Mm-hmm. He looks nice. Yeah, he like a drug dealer from the 2000s. Nah, nigga, nigga look like he going to play golf later. Nah, nah. But like the laid back golf, like rich golf. I have the Joe Rogan clip that, oh, okay. we, were, yeah, that we were searching yeah, for. Both of them got out of that clip. You guys. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. <laughs> Mm-hmm. California, right? They Not have their own cigarettes. They have non-menthol Newports. Hey, what the fuck? Why do black people like menthol so go. much? What's that about? <clears throat> it's a totally different type of cigarette. You're gonna get me canceled. No, um, this is very racist. This is conversation. <laughs> yes, Joe Rogan. Even, even though neither of us are. Go figure. Just talking about a type just, of just us that saying, enjoy? just saying, why do black people? Like you can just end it right so there, and it feels very a black, racist. A black <laughs> person actually getting ready to answer this. Oh, it's yeah, this is almost right there with his Black Panther comments. Uh, I don't think it is. Well, I don't mm. think it is either because yeah. we have a, a new. It's like if you started asking me about spaghetti, I'm not going to get offended. Joe Rogan, wait, what? You started asking me about Italian food or why? Why are Italian people so Joe. loud? I'm not going to get. How offended. How many people have ever died of pasta related? <laughs> a lot, Joe. A lot, a lot of pastas out there kicking the bucket, that's, bro. That's not well, that's good. That's over abundance yeah, of this, carbohydrates. People they better. were going to be fat wherever they lived, sir. <laughs> Maybe. That's an over going to be great bread eaters in Delicious high carbohydrates. This is food. such a great war of wits. They couldn't stop it. it people is. are addicted to food like they're addicted to anything. And if oh, there's a thing that I could ever be addicted to, it's that. Right. That's all of us, though. All of us. And what a blessing. Watch Cat, though. Yeah. Watch Big Cat, so Starving people are addicted exactly. to anything, and they don't have food-related illnesses. Exactly. exactly. But Uh-oh. back to where we were. Yeah. Then turned yeah, around and answered about, right. about just, the mm-hmm. menthol cigarettes. Oh, that's right. And, and the answer is... Um, I love the long pause. This nigga's great. Mm. Nah, he's smart. Very. But this is comedic time. We value strength in product. So there's this whole thing with liquor and malt liquor and the difference between the two and one is mm. richer and stronger. Oh, and, um, the more potent version. Right. Mm. And as, okay, that makes as sense. a people, we tend to go with those products. Things that are um, stronger. That makes sense. Right. Like before things were called concentrate. Yeah. Oh, you going there with him. We appreciate it. Oh, come mm, on. That makes sense. Come That's on, true. man. Come on. All man. cigarettes in California. How do you not love that? I cannot wait to finish watching. They can't trouble Like the thing with him is he he can't, it's hard to trip him up. Like he don't really uh overreact shit. He's well, very nah, intelligent, he, his, very well he, read. He'll yeah, his speaking, he'll he'll when we had him and you asked him a Will Ferrell question. And that shit was impromptu. Hmm. His answer was almost like he had a month to think about it and write that shit. That's how poignant his answer was in that moment. Hmm. And that shit was fire. I was like, okay. Like, he's different. His intellect is something different. They can't really trip him up. He talks about the book thing in, in the interview a lot. And, like, he sounds like he's very dead ass about how much he read. Like He probably is. Like he was talking about how they were clowning him on the internet about how I forgot how many it books like he said. Three thousand books a year. Astronomical, but he's like he broke it down. Like no, I've read these two hundred fifty page books, and that would make me read another book to learn more about this book because I can't finish this book until I learn about what the fuck they're talking about. And he's a very smart dude. I'm just happy Rogan is back on YouTube. Ten books a day, and <laughs> I'm gonna finish this. Nah, yeah. Cause, cause, mm-hmm. cause this was it just, seems like this was it seems like I'll enjoy it. This was great. Rogan ain't gonna sleep until he beat that Shannon Sharp fifty million though. <laughs> I think it's at sixty something now, but whatever, it, whatever is that. I don't think he's gonna catch that. That's a hard one. That's tough. Yeah, it's a, it's a hard one. If anybody could do it, it's him. But who, who do you who do you think he would have to do it with? He got to go Trump or somebody. Hmm? Who Trump or somebody? He got to go get a Trump. Hmm. He got to go. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. I think Rogan is so obscure. 
he can go sit with some astronaut nigga. He can go sit with somebody and, and that shit will just start flying. I, I, listen, he been gone for a minute, so we ain't felt that Rogan presence because it was tied up in that Spotify. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But Exclusive he back. So yes. you got to deal with it. Yeah. Th that's just that. He gonna, she going to show you why he's him. Mm -hmm. It ain't going to take a Trump. Shit, if he's down with, let me not start naming names, give these niggas ideas. It's hard. <laughs> I was trying to run them in my brain. It, it, it would be hard. He has to sit down with somebody that's going to say a whole bunch of just wow, left, go left shit. Not left as in political left, but just left as in Oscar, just some wow just, shit. Yeah. Like Cat Williams got up there and just went crazy that nobody expected. Shannon didn't expect that. You know what I'm saying? He yeah. just was like, in action, and he just went. Yeah, and then once and it that just took algorithm off. go, yeah, all of them take off. off now. It just took off. Every one of Shannon's interviews yes. go now. Yeah, yep. that's true. That's true. All of them. You damn near say Cat made the show. He did. Yeah. But that's the same as saying Ray J made Breakfast Club. Like, there's no shame in that. Ray J's call when he was beefing with Fab. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. That's like the niggas saying the Drake rant made this show. True, mm -hmm. true. Like, if you got a show, then you're gonna need a moment mm -hmm. where you go it's catapult you. Yeah, yeah. Where, where you separate, where you yourself. get alerted by the masses. Like, oh shit. Yeah, I don't think Shannon even anticipated that with that cat mm -hmm. shit. But so once either. it's here, they on a roll. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They on a roll. It's up to, once I'm, it's here. It's up to you to what you do with it now. Yeah, yeah so. I do want to go see his Terry Crews interview that he dropped. I watched. Some of it. I watched a little bit of that. Yeah. What do y'all think? It was pretty good. They, uh, they were, they talked about white chicks a lot, <laughs> in a way that <sighs> the white chicks in a way the movie. Uh, Mel, <laughs> yeah, word. <laughs> like, why are you acting like Mel? <laughs> yeah, what's going on? They, Fuck they were uh, talking about it as if it was a, a highly revered classic, which maybe in some circles it is. I don't necessarily agree. Are you talking about the movie? The movie. The movie. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, oh, boo. I thought you oh, there was a talking about milk. Talking, no, no, yeah. no, 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 no. I'm thinking you're I'm talking, talking about the movie. About Thought they was running out of lips or something. But there's a lot of other shit in there. Mm -hmm. From what I saw. Speaking of white girls, fucking uh who's that? NLE Chopper, he ain't wanna let Jeannie Bus go, huh? That was yeah. a long hug. Mm -hmm. it was that a, was it a was long hug. It, it was a hug. double hug. I thought that nigga yo, you, 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 I thought about you immediately. No, I thought it's about jealous. you. You how'd you think about me? I thought you That's your girl. I thought I thought you showed him your thumb move. <laughs> oh. He was up on her shoulder like <laughs> my, my thumb move that you never copied, right? I never. I don't touch you don't need to, right? I don't touch strangers, man. Everybody got their own. Oh, 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 that was nasty. That was nasty. That was disgusting. That was crazy. What are you talking about? You went low, my nigga. How? That was apple bottom jeans, nigga. No, wow. You taking it like touch strangers. I'm talking. Yo, y'all yeah, niggas acting like y'all never it. seen that nigga in action. Oh, no, he gets busy with the oh, right, then. I'm just Ooh, saying the way you worded that was a little, you know. Yeah. He genie. No, nigga had genie with the. I've seen a few niggas in this crew bite that move and be successful with it. Not me. You know not me. You ain't seen me. You know, I know you. Gotta be you. <laughs> I know not you. Know you. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 you. Yo, this guy is <laughs> nuts. Yo, <laughs> oh, man. Yo, that's that ish.com. <laughs> <laughs> Top the hoodies, Yo, all colorways. That get that consultation. It, 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 yeah. 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 Well, we'll get the consultation. It's, it's someday. <laughs> Cause summer coming, <laughs> oh, it's getting man. hot. Yo, Spring and wrong, summer coming. What's wrong with you, man? He ain't gonna want to sit down and talk to you niggas about no house. Nah, That's nah, why he got the watch, is to keep the hour. You know what I mean for the consultation. For real, mm -hmm. nigga, he got me home fucking challenging myself for my merch that's coming. I got free an uh, hour mood music talk. <laughs> <laughs> we could talk <laughs> about your favorite mood music, man. Yeah, God that shit, that shit, damn it, that nigga, that different. Shit go crazy. You better be, be careful what you say. <laughs> oh no, I'm joking. Yeah, yeah, you better don't put that out there. I ain't playing with niggas. Be ready. That nigga. Charge 150 and the shipping and handling ain't free. <laughs> they had that 14 on it. My shipping and handling was free for the first 200 people. Stop your shit and stop mm -hmm. hating. Nigga, when you order something off the internet, the shipping be free? Mm. My mom ordered everything for me, so I don't Ask know. us the shipping free. I will. Y'all ain't yeah. even miss what he said. He only has to get 200 people. Let me do the math. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, pull that calculator hey, out. Let me do the math. 200 at 150. If, if, they, if they charging the, the shipping and handling, yeah, yeah. that I mean, we passed 200 yeah, already. Ooh. 30 piece, nigga. <laughs> a 30 piece, you motherfucker. Yo, this thing is terrible. Is, <laughs> can I get a hoodie? Can I, can I get can a I watch? Get, can I get 10? <laughs> nah, I need a watch. You could have got me a little something with, the small, got the, with yeah, a small band. You smart? 
Uh, what was we talking about? All right, shout out to Joe Rogan. Shout yeah. out, to, shout out to Cat yes, Williams. Yes. Go watch that interview if you haven't seen it. Uh, this nigga here is different. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga brain is different, yo. Anyway, and I think it's time for Prize Picks. Prize Picks is the number one daily fantasy sports app in North America. Super easy and exciting to play, especially if you're a great strategic thinker. All you have to do is select two or more players. Look at their projected stat line. Doesn't matter the sport. There's no NFL, but you could do NBA. You could do hockey. Baseball is here now. College sports are here. Have at it. Why don't you? Uh, but if you pick two more, two or more players, uh, look at their projected stat line and pick more or less and hit, then you have a chance to win up to 25 times your money. And on the special demon picks, a chance to win up to 99 times your money. Mm -hmm. So please do not forget to use the promo code JBP. And good luck to all you beautiful people out there. That's right. I need some I'm, 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 on, I'm on a little three-day three, three day streak. Not Let's I, go. Okay. Not I. I turned the corner. I'm back. I'm back. I told y'all I was coming back. <laughs> wow. Bum-ass Poe, we went to Nashville. All him and Keeb could say was, oh, they got pride. Price picks out here. Oh, price, price picks is working out here. I gotta put, make my picks right now. I gotta put them in. Yo, that shit got him fiend out at the no, breakfast no, table. No, no, no. It's different. For real. I feel him. Did you hit? See? Another one. Nice. Let's go, Yo, folks. Like yeah, Yo, why you ain't sh why you ain't share? Paul, nigga. start sharing your You send them dumbass pictures. Send some Spanky oh, over to them. Damn, that's fucking oh, I didn't even say that. That was crazy. Oh, that was crazy. That was crazy. You know you my, you know you my wow. man. Wow. Oh, don't do any of this nigga solos anymore. Oh. Don't do, yeah, you need a time out there. Pew, 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 That was wild. That's my man. I would definitely prefer the Spanky, though. <laughs> Yo, and I know some people out there that are selling picks. I shouldn't say that right after that. All right, we'll talk later. We'll talk later. We'll talk later. Uh, what? Selling picks. Selling picks. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Miss the bus for a change. Why don't you? Uh, where y'all want to go? Uh, we got music. Man, rest in peace, Richard Lewis. How about that? Yeah, please, yeah. man. Rest please. in peace to the OG. The fucking legend. Oh, man, that one hurt. And Virgil. Rest in peace, Virgil. And Virgil. But Richard Lewis really fucked me up. They both fucked yeah. me up. That shit fucked you. Have you guys been watching Curb? I have not. Oh, the last episode that came out last week, they were, him and Larry were talking about putting each other in their wills. And Larry was like, yeah. talking about he's going to outlive him, all types of shit. Oh, wow. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Uh, and I don't know Richard Lewis from Curb. I'll be either, but oh. he's... Prominent on Curb and has yes. been the entire run of the show. Lot, yeah. I know him from the late night shit back in the 90s. That's mm. where I really first. And he was lit back then? Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> Richard Lewis? Yes, sir. Absolute luck. Do we know how Virgil passed? Virgil uh, from WWF, uh, Million Dollar Man. Million Dollar, million dollar Man. Y'all know Virgil. Some of y'all might be too young to know Virgil out there. but God. You know Virgil? I do. He should. I you know better who. know who Virgil is, Mr. Wrestler. Virgil's the black man. <laughs> no. You better know who Virgil Ted is. Ted DiBiase, man. Yeah. Come on, know Virgil, Here we man. go. Okay, okay. Yeah. Here we go. I'm, I'm okay. on my shit with y'all niggas, man. Good. I'm glad you got you got your anime shit out the way, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't. Your little your, uh, one, piece one Piece review. Don't say, don't say little. I, know, I can't say little. I can't. That word be getting me fucked up. <laughs> no. Shout out to One Piece. And he just says he um, just passed peacefully at the hospital yeah. at 61. He's only Rest 61. That's oh, so man. sad. Rest in peace to Virgil. But yeah, they didn't share the cause yeah. of death. That's, they don't have to. They don't have to work. Mm -hmm. Just rest in 61. peace. 61. Rest in peace, Virgil, man. Or Gone but not forgotten. Big part of my childhood and upbringing. Back. Mm. Yeah, yeah, you can't use you can't use little when describing nothing. Nothing, no, that's all. disrespectful. And I keep doing that a lot, but I you, just you know who like to use little when they when they mad and want to women shit on women. Yo, whatever you <laughs> want. That's their shit. Yo, you no. with your little friends, you go with your little bitch ass niggas too. <laughs> I seen your little boyfriend. You be like with his little S class. Like, all right, dog, you got it. <laughs> you got it, dog. You got it. I hate oh, us. Uh, I guess I'll hit the round of applause to all of us AT&T gang. We got $5 back yeah, man. from that major outage. Yeah, Salute man. for y'all. Now, I, y I didn't experience that outage, but a lot of people I know I. did. And I, I wish just, I would have. I was just shocked <laughs> to see AT&T offer $5 to that those people. Crazy. So I, I was mad when I was still getting phone calls. Like, God, man, why didn't they you, get me? You was in the crib? <laughs> yeah. Wi-Fi. I was how, tight. They had a, how long? 
a couple hours. Yeah, every day. it was, it was a while. It was almost all day, like mm-hmm. at least half the day. Oh, that's yeah. for five dollars. People yeah. were tripping. Yeah, but it was bad. Like everybody's phone went to SOS mode. Yeah, nigga, I need couldn't more even, than five dollars. Couldn't even. Contact nine one one if you need it. Like I didn't even know niggas still use AT and T, nigga, until I heard this nigga talk about it. Yeah, I didn't. Even I thought T Mobile and Verizon just took over AT and T. Yo, don't say that again. <laughs> <laughs> niggas don't use AT and T. I thought he was gonna say Verizon or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you use AT and T, man. Never throw T Mobile in there. Again. Hold on, wait, wait, okay. Mel, do you use AT and T? Yeah. Y'all better, y'all better go look up some <laughs> shit. Y'all better. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm saying that. T-Mobile got they foot in all their asses as of today. AOL ass niggas. I'm just no, I mean like now, currently. T-Mobile has T-Mobile up, up, that, everybody's man. speed. They shitting on it's not even close no more. Yeah, it's not. Once they bought Sprint and bought them towers, it's Yo, just no, it's Verizon and everybody else. But don't no, it's just not. say. No, Verizon's up there. Verizon's up there. I'm, I have T-Mobile. Verizon's number one. Verizon's up the top. But don't, don't put that AT&T don't bet? slander like um, T-Mobile is chump. T-Mobile had to merge with Sprint, right? AT&T had to merge with somebody too. Who they merge with? Singular. Singular. What's the niggas with a C? Yeah, Singular. Oh, yeah. AT and T. Nobody <laughs> uses that shit no more. That's with AT and T. Listen, I'm not, T, I'm not getting T. I'm not getting T. What do we, what do we want to give get? Give Verizon. You, you, you want to bring a sidekick, nigga? You, nigga you, <laughs> yes. Yeah, you nigga. Get, yes. You get, get a sidekick hey, again? You, you get, Hell yeah. You get a lot bring of money, back. my nigga. You get a lot of money. Go get some. Go get Verizon, my nigga. Verizon service works anywhere, no matter where you have. Verizon is the top notch. Cell phone provider. Okay. I feel like well, we're number one. Yeah, right yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I'm my fault. Great, 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 great grandfather. Oh, in. I see what he's doing. Oh. oh. No. Oh, yeah. no. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. 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 That was crazy. No. That was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you hear yeah. me now? Yeah. I mean, he opened his eyes. Let me do it. I see what you're doing. I didn't I do that, nigga. You did. You did with the slogan and all that. You good, because we ain't even catch it. Nah, Drewski, Drewski putting his foot in his ass. Let me go get Verizon. Oh. 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 I'm with you. That's a good one. That's a good one. Right Everybody there. was tagging me like, yo, your man T and message on Drewski. Yeah, nigga, I gave him the permission to go up there, nigga. Permission? Uh-huh. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, he was signing me. I gave him. He said, you go up there, have fun. He did good. The Asian kid, TMS, too much mm-hmm. swag. Gave permission to go up there. Shout him out. Yeah. <laughs> still got him signed? <laughs> them shout outs to tell it every time, boy. Wow, what, what's the shout outs? <laughs> you chatted him out already. A couple yo, times. Why you, gotta, why you gotta do that? Yo, why you gotta TMS. <laughs> yo, yo, don't forget. <laughs> TMS, you killed that shit. <laughs> Too much swag. He even told us what it meant. <laughs> thank, me, thank me soon. <laughs> thank, thank, thank me soon. <laughs> thank me sooner than later, nigga. <laughs> um, what else? What else? What else? What else oh, we got man. that's important? Listen, we, we, y'all wanna get the music or no? Uh, Let's get the music. We good? Right. Let's do cool. it. Car- Cardi's back. I like it. Mm-hmm. You like it? I like it. Do we have it a little bit? I yeah. got you. Okay. 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 I got you. I'm just, I'm just asking. Get, get, get you get you um, she put her, her, it's a freestyle. It is. Mm-hmm. Over Missy's. Uh, she's she's, she's a bitch. Yeah, I don't say I like it. Not mad at it, but I'm not blown away by it either. I like the concept of her just doing some. Freestyle shit, quote unquote freestyle Ain't shit. Damn freestyle, man. No, it's not a freestyle. I mean, nothing is a freestyle. It's a sold single. It's just because it ain't going to perform well, we're not going to call it a. Nah, I don't think so. I think it was low effort compared yeah, to. That's what I'm, so yeah. I can call it a freestyle. Yeah. It sets the bar of expectation. Yeah. yeah. I don't like it. Um, it's, it's, for, for, it's for Cardi to be going so long for with her, a single by herself. This is set up. This is a setup. She's got a product coming or a, uh, yeah, another, a big single like she, coming or something. This is a. But it, just, sound like, it sound like she was dissing niggas. I don't care. And it sounded like she was on the ride, you know, ever since, you know, Megan and Nikki going back and forth. She just wanted to catch some of that steam by throwing her two cents into it. That's how I took it. So I was excited about it. And then Lotto and Ice Spice. So I felt like, you know, I felt like it was the right time to do that. I thought it was dope. I liked it. Y'all yeah, ain't going to want to hear it from me, but the girl rapper wave is over. Damn. Damn. Oh, come on. Just telling you what it is. I'm normally a few months ahead with this stuff. Sometimes a few years ahead with this stuff. When you say over, why do you say that, nigga? You just yeah. said it was the, the girl, the girl, the girl rapper wave is is finito. How you just changed? So. You just said a couple of weeks why? ago that it was lit. I wonder why. No, I'm, I said the cream rises to the top, so Lotto shall remain. She will. Uh, Flo Millie shall remain. Got it. Uh, Rhapsody will always be there, but she wasn't really a part of it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. uh, but all of that, go find a girl, send her to Columbia, 
get it done, put her in the studio with fucking Mike Will or any one of them niggas. Mm -hmm. All of that planting the girl in the scene, getting the record, and it taking off, that wave is over. I think labels are looking at it like very few of y'all are selling records. It's too much work to get your coin back. We got to go do brand deals all over the world with y'all. Y'all are expensive. Some of y'all are annoying. And none of these records are working. But none of these records are working. Well, and let me, now let me get to Cardi B. Cardi B is afraid. And I'm tired of just nobody saying it. Cardi B is scared to come out. It don't take this long to come out. They recently just found every year where she plugged that she was coming, dating back to 2019. It's like six different slides in different years of you saying, hey, I have something coming. Even this freestyle was previewed a year ago. For real? Oh, see, I didn't know that. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah this was, she was on live from somewhere and played this shit. This ain't, this ain't new off the stove. Mm. Offset the other day in his story. Yeah. yeah. I wish my baby would just drop. Mm. I thought what that was are part you of the afraid setup? of? Right? And I'm just thinking about how Cardi B has reacted to uh, tweets that she dislikes, just any comment that she dislikes. I, I think that she's afraid to put a project out mm. because the wave of if you put a project out and it don't do what it's supposed to do, you're donezo. Rates go down. And, Prices go down. And not just that. She got a high bar to keep up with with her mm -hmm. last project. Exactly. So now you got added pressure. You got a, a wave that's saturated right now with uh, women rappers who are killing shit. And you got an, an arguable classic album to follow up. So it's, it's double the pressure for her. The problem, the problem I have with what Joe was saying because he extends a lot of the R and B acts. Grace, oh, you come take it, come out in six years, or even Kendrick. I heard him say, you know, give grace to as far as you know. We're waiting for the project yeah, six years, five that, years. They, they, they aren't. I want to be clear, but I, Kendrick is the exception, not the rule. Got it. R and B rules are also not rap rules. Got it. I'm saying as far as the labels going to get I, Meg, eh, Cardi. And Nikki really don't count because she's such a staple. But even that with Cardi, right? Like a little birdie had told me, fucking, I'm going to just spill it, that whenever Nikki was trying to drop or whenever Cardi was trying to drop, Nikki was trying to drop. And that's why Nikki kept changing dates. Don't quote me on nothing. But Nikki changed that date like five times trying to match up with whenever Cardi was dropping. And that was supposed to be the big... I mean, if we just as consumers looking at it, that was supposed to be the 50 Kanye. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that, I feel like, would have helped Cardi. Mm -hmm. Nikki, mm -hmm. I think, was going to sell whatever she was going to sell regardless. Mm -hmm. But Cardi, I think, would have gotten a big boost and just catapult from that marketing. It didn't happen, and then Nikki dropped. I ain't spoke to nobody up there at Atlantic, but I think Cardi backed out of that. I think she ran from that. And now we about to be in March, spring, mm. summer, year six. Mm. It got to be something this year, this summer. This year. It has to be. Six. Album? Album. Yeah. By the summer. It has to be. If not, you might as well just. I think a lot of these women, girl rappers are going through uh, city girls drama and keeping it low. Like, what do you mean? I just mean where the branding is louder than everything yeah. else. Mm. Got it. Well, that's me, what I was going to say. Ask when you, when you, hold on. When you spoke to um, the labels, it's too much work with them. They're not getting their coin back. You got to look for brand deals and stuff. If Not saying Cardi, but some of these newer acts especially. If they said, let's say they sign you to a 360, do they care as much if they don't get the money back in, in, in music? If we do yes. go get you brand deals over here and we use that and we make our money off of this? I think for so. Like, like a, for example, not no shots at anyone, but like a Saweetie. Sweetie don't really put a project out, but she keeps a brand deal somewhere mm -hmm. now. It's so, over. But I'm just saying, so for someone like and, her, and see uh, what I mean? That whole wave. Sweetie just dropped a record. She did. Albums. Over. I, I'm even for sweet, over for Sweetie. For but even yeah. with you I don't saying, understand. But I don't, with not, no disrespect to nobody. Um, with, with, with certain rappers, female mm -hmm. rappers, mm -hmm. they can't be branded in a in a really 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 large way like Sans Cardi Sans Nikki Sans Meg a lot of these girls you got real limited people that you could even do a brand deal with 
Yeah. If you the label. Sweetie's kind of like, like Sweetie's kind of like in a class of her own though. Limited. Brand you know? deals hey, with Dunkin' Donuts hey, all this hey, time. Hey, she ain't got an album. Let, let's slow down for a little bit. All brand deals don't go in the same pool. Sure. That's what I'm saying. So I don't want to say look at Ice Spice who's running around with Taylor Swift and on Super Bowl commercials. Mm-hmm. Meg, go, Meg, Rock Nation, gonna make sure Meg Absolutely. keeps mm-hmm. something going on, Correct. and they've done a good job mm-hmm. in landing with Cardi, making sure she all Correct. up. Brand I took them out. I took them out. And that, yeah, but and that's where it stops. Whatever Sweetie is doing, don't look like what they doing. Sure, the Not bag is music. a lot. I'm Not, just talking about the brand. Yeah, well, yeah but, that's what I'm saying. But I agree with you, Ice. If you in a 360, I'm gonna go get it. The labels do want them to put music out at some point. One it, hand washes the it other. It makes you yeah. easier to brand the if you got an album. It makes out at you some easier point. to brand. Your popularity is how we sell Doritos on you, or Correct. how we sell Popeyes mm-hmm. on you, or how we but, sell such and such. But with, with, I don't want to keep going to her, but sweetie. Sweetie's fine. That's what I was about to say. That's why I was going to say she's she kind of in a class by herself. She don't have to have no real music to keep exactly. that popularity going for her. Was she the girl that was a recon girl? That's, girl. That's, that's not, she not true. Have to. Was she that's the not true. That's, that's not, not true. That ain't that's enough. not enough. That right ain't now, enough. Because we could go get any Instagram girl. No, right, no, right now, right now it is. I was literally sitting with a publicist who was like talking about doing like another deal with Sweetie. He was like, they were like, Pete, brands love her because she is so stunningly beautiful. You know what I mean? Like that's going to carry her for a long time. At what rate? At what it's rate? over, girl. Hmm? At what rate? I mean, I don't know it's what over. her rates are, but because I mean, again, it's not, it's it, not yeah, peanuts. Yeah, but if the publicist ain't highlighting that, then yeah, it don't negate matters. what we're saying. That matters. It's a bunch of cute, it's a bunch of fly women, not even mm-hmm. cute, mm-hmm. really, really highly attractive women, right? And so if you don't have to have the thing that draws the, the brand to you, I could go get any badass girl off Instagram. Nah, you can't. It's not the same. It's not quite the same. same. I'm not saying it is. What I'm saying is, if you putting out quality music, Uh that makes it easier to sell you to the brand. I Mm -hmm. agree with that. I agree with that. You have to put music out. You got to put something out. You have to have a quality product. You think it was hard to sell Meg to Nike? No. No. And I just also want to throw in there all of the women that we name and have have, or have had the star man. Oh, I didn't even think about that Mm -hmm. So, Sweetie had Quavo. Mm-hmm. So, who cares yeah. if you don't talk too much and if the song ain't rocking? You beautiful enough and, and there's the Quavo. Song. And she's good at, um, Sweetie in she particular, had... is good at selling some shit on Instagram. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. I can see why PR people and brands would like her. It's not just putting a pretty it face. Is, but it's not but only, she has personality. But it's that not she only that. With. She's kind of like, you know, I don't want to be killed for this, but it's true. She's kind of in her little socialite bag as well. Like she's able to do a lot of things that not just anybody can do because of what she looks like and the way that women perceive her. That's what I'm saying. Like you can put her in on a fa- fashion bomb daily and she's in an outfit and she's going to have like 20,000 likes. Whereas the average. Yo, y'all talking about yeah. crackhead shit. Hey, yo, what, wait, That's hold on. what I was about Yo, y'all to say. are talking about like, crackhead shit. That is the right minimal now. shit yeah. we talk. I'm talking about big brand Sprite. Like, you yes. know what I'm saying? I'm talking Cadillac. about that shit. Yeah, shit like that. Like, Wasn't she, she a ring card girl? Shit. Didn't she do that ring card shit? Crackhead shit. That shit would come on, man. But wait, Stop now it. listen, because I don't even want to make it like seem like we're thing. harping on Her. Sweetie not... or just the, the female MCs, because I do think that the broad picture is it applies to rap, period, currently. And that is the talk at some of these labels. I, I, think, is I think so. We I think not it's been that way for a long time. Yeah, I think but I think happens. it's getting highlighted. I, I think, think a lot, I told y'all, I think a lot of these rappers went in with that mentality. Yo, let me get hot here so that I could bounce over here and then start doing all this shit and I ain't got to put this music And out. I think the product mm-hmm. is starting to show that. that that shit is caca. Let me play A lot of word. these rappers can't rap, yo. Even That's the true. niggas that y'all be highlighting up here, I'll be like, that shit don't be that fire to me. Because I'm listening for content, I'm listening for lyrics. Y'all be like, yo, lyrics don't matter. I think you only got a certain amount of time when you could just keep doing that. I was hanging out with a uh, 22-year-old kid that's like in the rock scene, white kid. And he was talking about how music today, it's not, the songwriting isn't important. And this is a kid that's like artistically talented and all that shit. He's like, we played him some shit we were working on, he played some shit that he was working on. All of it was dope, but he's like, it's hard to find good songs today. It's more about a vibe. That's all people mm-hmm. give a fuck mm-hmm. about. Mm-hmm. But then that music don't last. Agreed. It Agreed. I want to play uh, some words from a friend of the show, Vince Stables. The music industry is going to last much longer. As as far as what? As a concept. Oh, nah, it's over Fucking with. Fucking pianos. Yeah. yeah, it was over when Mike turned white. 
That was the sign. It was that over that long ago? Mm -hmm. White Mike was the start. It's like global warming, like it's going to be sprinkled throughout. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but then White Mike died. And then it's like, that's the first sale, sporing. Well, you don't think White Mike dying was like a rebirth? Could have been? Symbolic? When did Spotify happen? 2009. And when did Mike die? Oh, sh <laughs> First of all, I love the the music, like the, the underlay. Spot. That I'm shit tired was of the piano fucking awesome. behind the podcast shit. Who was he talking to? Uh, I don't know this guy, but this is a, this is a complex interview. Okay. Yeah, that boy is different. Vince Bear is Park. hilarious. Mm, he's different. Yeah, and if you're not a believer of what he says, it can come off radical. But this is at the core of our relationship right here. We've been having this talk for a few years now. We believe this shit to be coming. It ain't. I, I think it ain't they, what it I was. Think, I think they know it too, though. When I, I know. Say they, and they meaning, moving. They but they moving. They moving yeah. the pieces on the board yes. accordingly. Which is why we don't care about the music as much no more because it's only so much we're gonna get from that today. It ain't about the art no more. It ain't about none of that shit. They done milked it dry. So now let's get you hot. Let's put you over here where we can sustain you a little bit longer because nobody really gives a fuck about the music no more. And I think that is the, the, the plan coming from all the way up top. So it, when it trickles package. down to them. That is so sad. That is so sad. Sell a brick. <laughs> That's why all these companies... Go figure it out. That's why all these <laughs> Go companies be creative. Buy, buy in other companies too. They build in a market share with their current roster and I'm going to sell. Because I know the shit out of here. I ain't mad at him. I think the Cardi mm -hmm. shit is cool. Let me bring it back to what we was talking mm -hmm. about. I think, I think the Cardi freestyle is cool. The visuals were dope. I, I think mean, Cardi I'm going to think it's cool because all anybody going to sound good over She's a Bitch beat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That beat is just too fire. If you got a flow and a cadence, you're going to sound good. So Cardi does sound good. But at, after six years, no, I'm, I need the single. That's, what I'm, that's why I don't like this. I, it's Bodak Yellow Time. It's Exactly. I think she got more. Well, that started off as freestyle. I think that that's kind of what she was trying to do here a little bit. Stop it. I'm serious. I think she got Stop more. Stop it. She's such a major star. She can go get anybody she wants to. Bodak Yellow yeah, didn't with. start off as a freestyle. Yes, it, did. it started off as a mixtape record. Yeah. Like it, was still a, it was still a, a verse and a hook. There's a hook on this. It is. There, there is a hook on this. Same format. Is. And she quickly added another verse to that, and then they... It, took off and it is what it is. I don't see that for this, but I'm talking about it's time for that level of impact. Oh, well. That's what I mean. Yeah. It's time now. I think that this was an attempt at that, though. See, I don't hear it. Mm. I don't hear it. Do you think that taking... Because I, I imagine okay. her to get more in her anthem bag when it's, when it's time to. This ain't... I, Cardi Bag is call and response. DJ mute the shit. Y'all finish the ball. Yes. I don't hear that. I don't hear none of that. Stylistically, this it. don't sound like she was going for that level of impact. But she and, even and, got that on her feature. Records. I think Bodak was an accident to some degree. I totally agree with that. Like I don't think that was a intended. Oh, this is going to be a great call and response record for DJs. So, no, I think she just went in on the fucking Kodak beat mm -hmm. and did her little flip of the Kodak flow, no and the fucking shit went. I also don't know how many of those people are still around. That's true, too. I think those layoffs, yo, have killed a ton of artists. Like, That's music is so ever uh, quickly changing mm -hmm. and, and, and constantly evolving that when you try to come back after a long, long, long layoff, that shit don't always hit. I, we've seen artists that was hot as fish grease do that layoff. Yeah, but in yeah, that but layoff, it's supposed to be tour or brand deals or both. Mm -hmm. And then you come back. But that's how the artists survive during these layoffs. But that's what she's done. She's done. The part we missing yeah. too. At like, some point, during, you have to go and you got to come back. During her layoff, be clear, she's featured versus us to death and they have been fired. She smoked yeah. them all. So it ain't like it's been complete silence and now you popping back out. Yeah, exactly. She dropped her singles even though she's she, yeah, he had a couple singles. We ain't seen nothing that say that that single, that single slider is still at 100. No. Well, no. Not since no, Wap. No. Yeah. Yeah. Not since Wap. That's what I got for y'all, man. I didn't mean, mean I didn't want to huh? bring up. A little bit, yeah. That's but it. But not that's nah. not a hundred. That's That's it though. Yeah. I didn't mean to bring down the energy. No. Sorry. I feel like something Sorry. is gonna come. We'll we'll see. I hope it does. Tell me what it looks like if 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 the third and fourth quarter go by and nothing comes. That's a dub. Yeah. 
Hang it up. And now we in 2025. Dub. And Cardi is promoting. That would be crazy. Got something coming. Dub. It's a wrap. Forget about it. It's a wrap. For music. I'm not saying like oh, yeah. career, it, life, or, you know. And she's, but that's she's why like, women she's go, been able to do this this long. Women because I don't have to focus on music. the system and they say can't. I'm pregnant. <laughs> Women could come up with some shit now where you got to give mercy and grace. I've been battling. I've been battling something. Yeah. <laughs> My mental health, it'll be something. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, what else? What else in music? Schoolboy Q. Schoolboy Q. Yeah, what are we man. talking about? Wow, the nerve us to do Blue all lips. of that. Yeah, yeah I was heard. waiting for y'all. To, yeah, yeah. Y'all, shut up. Y'all. Schoolboy Q, Q dropped uh, Blue Lips and... That nigga must have been threatening you, yo. Fam, I am objective, <laughs> my nigga. <laughs> that nigga was threatening you, yo. You played the nigga sleeper. That, that shit, shit was hard. That shit, yeah. that shit was hard. Ooh. Hey, I ain't got no beef with none of you niggas. Put good music out. That shit I say it all the time. This album, fire. You heard it? You heard it uh, I listened to it one and a half times, and I'm adjusting. Mm-hmm. It goes... Uh, <laughs> There's there's quick, it goes from soul sample or jazz sample to aggressive turn up shit and back, back. very frequently. And that, and that fucked me up. That's, just, fuck, that's fucking me up. I like, I like it. it. I like it. I like it. But I need to live with it for a little bit. I may, yeah, I may need to do the same. I don't like it while I'm showering. <laughs> same, same. Yeah, that's exactly where I listen to it in the morning on the phone. Oh, it sounds kind of good. Let me put it in the speaker while I'm showering. Put oh, it in the car see. on the way here, and it's like it sounds fire. But I gotta. I how gotta, would you have liked it? I had, no, I had the, jazzy I had the in the album. front, and then turn up at the this end. This is how he started his album. I they know. don't get no jazzier than I this. I love this. It's gro- yeah, groovy. Oh, jazzy. this was a vibe. Super vibe. See, I ain't like this at first. Oh really? Yeah, I thought this was a. My first listen was in the car. I got the album this. sent to me yesterday. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, come on, man. This what is smooth. You don't really do nothing. I don't yeah. care. Yeah, I like it. I like this. No, y'all know I'm big on how an artist starts his album. Huh? Because it tells me where his mind is and where he's trying to go. Fine, I'll get to the next one. See, look, no. You just fucked me up. Well, when I saw it said featuring Rico Nasty, I kind of yeah, you knew know what to you know expect be, yeah. off already. I wasn't looking at the track list. Again, wow. I had it in the car. So it popped up. I'm like, okay, this is going to go at some point. We can ready to go. See, I'm here. I'm here. Ooh, this is nice. This is nice. Mm-hmm. And then? And then it goes Yeah, hand. I'm jamming right now. Uh-huh. That. Yep. Loud. Yep. Loud. Was it? Hard. It was hard. Mm-hmm. That loud. Rarely do I get a song, especially early in the album, that I don't make it to the next record right away. <laughs> especially when I'm just like, if I'm going to drive and I'm giving it, it a again? car. I ran this back. Yeah, I brought mm-hmm. that one back a bunch. Like, when the beat dropped, I'm telling you, some shit just took over in the car. Mm. Next thing you know, oh shit, I'm doing 96. Let's, let's relax. Let's relax. Let's relax. You're still black That's driving. Oh, you trying to go jail. Yeah, 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 yeah. Relax. I relax. <laughs> you still black driving. <laughs> hey, it's listen, crazy, yo. But no, um, and then the album, I, I'm with y'all. It does its uh it's ebbs and flows, which I like. I like I'm, the dynamics of that. I, I just gotta get used it. to it. I like that with him. Me too. So I wasn't mad at the project. Long again, long wait. True. When you come back with something that sounds like I took my time. I tried. And I wanted to give y'all some something that my fans would enjoy. Mm-hmm. I I applaud it, bro. Yeah, something that's, that's what different. This sounds like. Pushes pushes the needle. Exactly. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do the same. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what Solo sounded like too. Yeah. True. Yes. Actually. Yeah. Yes. He did. He did. Different. But that yeah. was kind of what's cool about Black Hippie. And I love TV all of the beat switching. Like, <sighs> I have so not good. heard the album in its entirety because. Uh, I don't remember now. You haven't heard the album in its entirety. I haven't heard the album in its entirety, but I look forward to doing so. I was moving around, moving and shaking last night. Mm. This is a good one. It's really good. This is a good one. This is a good one. I like the track with Jazzy on it. And um, shit. That's why I play that for a sleeper. And uh, what was the other one? Yearn 101? That's when I played. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at you. Uh, Yeah, yeah. I like School by by Q. Mm. Okay. I can see that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> we'll let you know when he's coming up here. So you shut can... up. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> no, she probably hey, won't hey, be. Hey, that's, oh, that, oh, that's, that's hate. Right, that's She's right. going to do a that's movie. Right. Uh, I just single shame. him out. He ain't even say nothing. Pew, pew, pew. pew. <laughs> she on his <laughs> pew, She been on his ass last couple pops. Facts. <laughs> Nigga, she was. Yeah, yeah nothing yeah. he can do about it. Neither helpless. <laughs> I said someone. What happened? Hello? No. <laughs> anyway, congratulations <laughs> to Schoolboy Q. Sure. I can't good wait. Shit, I can't wait to hear the rest of the project. 
Shout out to uh, all Q fans out there. I know y'all yeah, are happy. Y'all deserve this. I talked to a couple of them. They're like, yeah, talk that shit. And I said, bro, I know, but this is music. Yeah, I'm going to need edibles, some, some yak. This shit with was this fire. One. I like it. Shrooms. Could be. Uh, mm. Could be. Uh, what else came out in new music? Um, French Montana dropped a deluxe. Yo, Ice. Mm -hmm. Ice. All right, I'm sorry. Ice. Ice. I'm sorry, bro. Ice. I'm sorry. I love French like you. Me too, but, but he why do you keep doing this? Stop, man. Somebody got to tell him to stop. Did you hear the newest, the, the latest? Mm. There's more? Yes. So he, <laughs> did the, he did the vinyl pre-sale thing. Sure. Not mad at it. Of course. And Genius, $5. For the vinyl? Yes. Genius. Wait, so. do I get an hour consultation of <laughs> NYCHA, NYCHA uh, <laughs> apartments? <laughs> Yo, yo, that's, yo, stop hating on man. Yeah, that's nasty. We're gonna Nitra, jump you. We're gonna jump projects, you. nigga. All right, thirty minutes of I'm, how yo, Nitra buildings I'm, are changing. I'm, I'm team that ish today, so I see we'll it. jump you. I see it. So what happened? So people, I saw a post. People were like, yo, if you pre-ordered the uh, the the French vinyl, did you get it? Uh huh. So a lot of people was like, yo, I never. A lot of people, I mean, uh -huh. yo, I really didn't get mine. Yeah. So they posted a tracking number. Like people in, let's say Jersey, tracking number said just shit went to L.A. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Address is not yours. Mm -hmm. Then they show you know UPS will take the picture. Yeah, it's a bag like that. No vinyl ain't fit in there. So it's you can't buy no vinyl for five dollars. Seems to be some more. It's a scam. Fudging of the numbers. And if you ever yeah. really bought the vinyl, you wouldn't sell it for five dollars. Yeah, no, that's what I'm like when I say you can't buy. Vinyl for five dollars. I'm not talking about you as a consumer cannot go to the store. You might be able to find a five dollar record somewhere. Yeah. I'm talking about the you artist. as the artist to oh, press a record no. costs more than five dollars. Oh, yes, for sure. See, I didn't know that. A lot more because I'm looking at it. I'm like, normally when I see vinyl sales, it's twenty dollars, thirty dollars, and yeah. fifty dollars. There's a reason for it. It's and expensive. I'm like, because I'm looking at him, and, and you you're doing buy this. Him in bulk. Correct. And I was looking at this. If he's doing it to sell his vinyls prior to the album coming out to have you know better numbers. Uh -huh. A five dollar price point might be great because then, hey, more people. A five dollar school, I got that all day. You might not be able to do forty fives for five dollars. Little records, little little shits with a big hole in the middle. You might not yeah. be able to do those for five dollars. Honestly, let alone the big shit. And he had twenty one track album. That's the double. <laughs> might so be yeah, a tri might be a triple. Just, I'm just like I, I mean, yeah, I love French, true. but it, maybe it ain't even him. It could be somebody above or whatever. Y'all playing and people can see it. So we just want to point it out. Music games. Yeah. yeah, but the remember the music games when you couldn't tell the music games was being played, like unless you really knew. The average consumer don't know that. Term. No, the average consumers are on Twitter like, "Hey, yo, dog, I ordered this and I didn't get this." And then look, and now you're seeing a bunch of people saying the same shit. So like, oh, we were scammed. This is happening. An average t user is opening Spotify and seeing you have seven versions of your album covering the entire front page. It's like something just looks off. And it's bad because the music's actually good. And it's a good project. It is. It is. All this it, all it shit is broke shit. It's nasty. All, it's just nasty. This whole shit is, or the whole music business <laughs> is broke. Let me watch my words, man. I'm ready to go up. It bothers me that Usher can perform in front of 125 million people and sell 91,000 copies. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Something is wrong. Yeah, it is. It says, no matter the eyes we put you in front of, shit ain't there's a cap on We're this We're going to keep shit. you right here. Yeah, there's, yeah. A, there's a cap on this. And I th I'm, I think it's purposeful. Yeah. Well, it's, I think some real toxic shit when it comes could to be. the music business, could be. the music industry. Because if that was some other person labels. on that stage, they hold damn their discography would be shooting up the charts. I'm sure all this mm -hmm. shit did. The and then you dropped that, a new project? But the problem is that 91,000 sales is really hundreds and hundreds of millions of streams and that we that's don't eat foul. From. That you don't eat from. <laughs> yeah. It's nasty. This whole shit is a trick. It's nasty. Mm. Yeah. It's nasty. Music business is very nasty right very now. Very fucking nasty. And like I said, it's happening more and more, which is why a lot of people go in indie. Exactly. Because it's yeah. like, yo, I can see the tricks now. Before, we couldn't see them. I can literally or press up. Or if I only sell 150000 I'm getting all that bread. I can press up CDs or bread, records right? and go do a show at an SOB's-esque venue and so, sell them and make way more money in one night than I could. Facts with hundreds of millions of streams on the biggest playlist in the world. And that's what Nip, rest in peace, was saying before. Like, yo, I'm doing the music, but I'm, sell I'm selling the, the, the merch, basically. Yeah. I'm doing the music to give me a reason to travel 
Mm -hmm. To sell this merch right. I'm making my Look, money Off over here That's the same thing That we're talking about With Saweetie Or any of these other girls I have to put out music To be able to sell myself mm -hmm. To these other brands I'm, It's the same thing I get that I'm saying from the people That were controlling them gotcha. If I could just put you anywhere I'm making money off you Because I got you in a 360 Nip said I 360 myself True So it's like to them It's like yo alright cool You ain't you, You're cute You have something to sell Sex appeal That's your product Yeah Sell that Fuck your music I can put you in front of these places and brand you here. They like you, and I can sell something just based off of that particular product. I don't need your music to hit. It don't need to hit, but I feel like they still want a little something. I'm just saying, the, the, we, we're talking in circles on that. We while yeah. while we on this topic, I saw one of these little fuckity fuck publications. They were highlighting record labels. Like they did the top 10 record labels or some shit like that. Of oh. now or all time? Or? Now. Okay. And then it got to RCA, yeah, only which like I have in my hand here. Mm -hmm. And it says, Edge, Fleck, and team enjoying an ongoing hot streak with Flo Millie, Bryson Tiller, Tate, SZA, Doja, and more. With this much streaming, you've got to take Nipper out constantly. Nipper is their little mascot for RCA. So oh, that was a little, their little jokey joke there. Uh -huh. Okay. I don't understand how this could be published and not mention Mark Pitts. Mm, true. Mark Pitts, who is either responsible for or partly responsible for that whole shit, everything yeah. over there that's moving. Mark Pitts, who's been around forever. Mark Pitts is not the president of Urban over there. He's the president. This seems like they are purposefully. Could be. Yeah, I'll but make, they, make, it, it could be, shouldn't be cavalier for Word. me. <laughs> is, isn't Skane over there at RCA? Skane is over there as well. It's big up the Skane fam. You already know what it is. But that's odd. That Mark Pitts' name is not mentioned when you highlight RCA. Mm. Do you think with it all might... that he's done for RCA and music? Do you think it mm. could be like the age of the writer? That would still be a problem, though. No, I, I, I clearly it's this a problem, but like a lot of times, corrupt. yeah, this whole shit is a mess. It's a lot of shit going it's on. A mess. It's a and, fucking mess. And, and and it ain't too much that's accidental. Word. You're not you're not omitting Mark Pitt's name by accident when you speak about RCA. That was a big uh, messaging in the cat mm -hmm. cat interview. None yes. of this shit is accidental. <laughs> yeah, mm. I just wanted to get that out there. I didn't mean to bring down. No, 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 no. Nah, you didn't bring sorry. it down. You didn't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Man, they took his hand out of his pocket yet yeah. and won't. You fucking up the chemistry set. Oh, shit. I sit here every day with my hands on my pockets, ice. You, you, told me you don't know what I have worn no me. other day. I Why said, you getting so sassy? I'm yeah, sorry. Like I'm that shit, I have a smile on so my sassy. face, bro. I'm, I'm you don't good. sound like you was ready to lend him a coat. <laughs> you don't sound like. I'm just checking. All this for humility. Yeah. This guy's are nuts. That's our goal, yo. If we can get you to step mm -hmm. into it, we just want to see the watch. <laughs> that ain't, that ain't Russ nigga said I'm way more humble than you And I'm way I'll buy you nigga Way more rich than you <laughs> <laughs> Could these kids you? Yes <laughs> Yo You know my problem is with you I'm way more humble than you And I'm way more up than you nigga Fuck is you talking about <laughs> <laughs> He told me boy Oh uh, man Look he still won't take his hand out At all <laughs> He got the sticky tape on the on the watch To the <laughs> sleeve <What>? <laughs> He bought that shit, and he told him to clean it too. Put it under the cleaner for me. Shh. <laughs> you know the little shh. The steam cleaner. Look, he mad at us. Yo, yeah, he really not fucking with us. He's not fucking with us. Why'd you wear it if you're not Why gonna let you? it shine? Mm. Bling bling, bitch. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What's going on with you, lady? <laughs> She excited for this job. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this <shit>. little break. <laughs> what movie are you going to shoot? Yeah, you thought I would have bang. Bang, bang, bitch. Okay. No, I said bling, bling. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> got it. Respect. Yeah. Uh, right. What else? What else we got? What else do we have? Hopefully no more music. Oh, wait. That's not true. That's not true. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That okay. is not yeah. true. Uh, mine and Ish's favorite guy, fucking Kenyon Dixon. 
the R&B you love, soul of the 70s EP. I guess he's doing his Silk Sonic 70s, you know. But he did it. Mm. That's hard. You could hear it. That's hard. Yeah. Jam, jam session. You could, you could hear what he uh-huh. did. Yeah. Nice little six pack. Nice little six pack. That's the other thing. Niggas going five and six pack y'all to death with For the sure. music business. Yo, we gotta do an expose, man. God we gotta dude. uncover this shit. You kind of got. That's what they gotta do today. I gotta, gotta keep, keep some shit out. Yeah, and I gotta keep hitting you. Pause. Yeah. And y'all are consuming it at a fast clip. So I'm not killing so why myself. Would I kill, this yeah, why would I kill 21 myself? 21 track and have to put out seven different versions tracks, to make I, my money back. I put out 21 tracks. Y'all offered in two months. If, if that two long, months, I'm talking about completely off it where you didn't even drop. Two months where they asking you like, "Yo, dog, when you dropping again?" Like, no, you get a you get an EP. Yeah, you get an EP, five six piece. I'll be back in a couple months. Whole lot. That's it. That's mm-hmm. it. That's it, man. That's where the game is at. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, hard turn into cereal. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now I have not eaten cereal in a while. I eat cereal for dessert. Because yeah, as you get older, I can see cereal for dessert. Yeah. Like a bedtime snack. Yeah, because it's mm-hmm. fucking terrible for you. But I ain't I even done that in a while. Yeah, I don't, I don't even really. But when I was on my diet. That nigga's too good for cereal now? Nah, I was eating no, a little no. keto cereal. But oh, no. oh, okay. Wait, what? Keto oh. cereal? That shit ain't bad, but I that shit's nasty. Yeah, yeah, that shit before. You're bugging. What the fuck is wrong with like you? You're bugging. You put shit on Cashy? it. No, it's a few. No, hell nah. no. Okay. It's different ones. Some of them shits taste bang. Big ass boy. Yo, don't say that again with your sky dweller. Not keto. Yeah. Uh, you in a different league now. Buddy. Anyway, right? <laughs> Nigga took that Casio off. <laughs> took that little G Shock. G Shock. Yeah, he took that. This shit gone. <laughs> Techno Marine. What? 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 Put the that shit in the drawer. <laughs> uh, Kellogg CEO. Let's just play the clip. Category has always been quite affordable, and it tends to be a great destination when consumers are under pressure. So. Some of the things that we're doing is first messaging. We got to reach the consumer where they are. So we're advertising about cereal for dinner. If you think about the cost of cereal for a family versus what they might otherwise do, that's going to be much more affordable. The other places that we like to go is we talk about making sure we have the right pack at the right price in the right place. So having a different size pack that'll have a different price point, that'll take some pressure off the consumer while they're shopping. So those are some of the things that we're doing, but in, in general, the cereal category is a place that a lot of folks might come to because the, the price of a bowl of cereal with, with milk and with fruit is less than a dollar. So you can imagine why a consumer under pressure might find that to be a good place what to go. Right. I'm about? all for innovation and marketing, but the idea of having cereal for dinner, uh, is there the potential for that to land the wrong way? Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, we don't rich, think so. In fact, it's landing really well. All right, dog. Of course Yo, you dog. don't think so. Kellogg CEO you're a suggests rich white people man. should eat cereal for dinner to save money. Now, a hot topic up here has been the inflation uh, at the grocery, at the supermarket, yeah. grocery yeah. stores. Yes. Shit is indeed high out there. Uh, I guess if I'm the Kellogg CEO, that would be an opportune time to jump in and try to get niggas to eat cereal. <laughs> but this sounds nuts. Sounds that just sounds. He sounds so like detached. Tone deaf. He's just detached. Like you, rich motherfucker. You saying all oh, y'all bitching about not being able to afford food? Eat, eat a cereal. bowl of cereal. Yeah, rather than the problems of capitalism, and inflation, well, he and stuff like that. He is giving away an, a one-hour consultation of, with Raisin Bran. <laughs> is that what your consultations are going to sound raisin. like? <laughs> How Raisin Bran was created. So, I mean, it balances out. <laughs> I don't know if he's detached. <laughs> you fucking crazy. Fuck all the nutritional value fucking that you yeah. get from, from dinner. Yeah. Just eat cereal to save some bread. Yeah, the cost of a to... bowl of cereal with some milk and some strawberries c- less than a dollar a day. Eight dollars a box. Nigga, a Who is he of, talking to? I feel like we shouldn't continue this conversation without me knowing what everyone's favorite cereal is and then we can keep Fruity going. Pebbles. Uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Captain Crunch. Frosted Flakes slash Raisin Bran. Frosted Flakes well, go hard. Raisin bread. Hmm. I like raisin bread. Ah, uh, shoo. Cinnamon Toast Crunch is that, that shit. That's, that's it. Cocoa Puffs. Don't try to be down with us. Your family <laughs> own restaurants your whole life, nigga. I love cereal. <laughs> Me too. Oh, I man. eat a bunch of different your cereal. Your family does not. Hey, yo, you I, been, too. You, I switch you, them up. I switch them up. You've been, da- you been down with us. I had a bunch of them shit. You've been down with us, Pops. Cocoa Puffs. Cocoa, cocoa Puffs is that shit. Yeah, you been like Cocoa Puffs? What else is cocoa in that shit? Yeah, you've been like black girls. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you've been like chocolate. Only, only the Puffs? <laughs> only the Puffs. <laughs> the Puffs, yeah. Cocoa Ch- Mel, Chase. did you answer? Come no, on. No, I like uh, Special K. Um, All right. Oh. Oh. 
Mel. Special <laughs> Chip Kane. Well, it's What's the one, it's the one uh, with the fruit we and the yogurt. Grape nuts. Nuts. You like grape nuts? You and Special K. <laughs> 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 it's yum. It's good. No. Honey bunches of oats? Great. Yeah, honey bunches of oats. Okay, all right. No. This is their stock. No. They getting their ass whooped. What happened to make they should go Basically, down like this? Basically, now people keto. No keto, what? paleo. Yes, no, it is. No, yeah. Not. Oh no, they dropped. What's starting dropped. to happen is the oh. nutritional shit about cereals coming out across the world. Mad countries have banned like 20, 30 major brands of cereal, well, so they stock yeah, is getting their asses dollars. whipped because it's not healthy. It's the been, FDA would being if, linked to what cancer. It, what it passes as food cereal? in this country would yeah. does not pass in other countries. And, and now so that's so starting to be forefronted. People starting. To, it's articles coming out. Yo, this shit don't be food. No, it don't. No, it's, not. No. it's not. It's trash. It's not. And so now they stop getting the ass preservatives. Ra- ramen's still good, right? No. 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 Did you see the video on how ramen is made? Don't watch it if you want to keep eating it. Made. Don't watch I, it. I know how it's Did made. Did you see the video on how General Souls is made? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> There's no video like General. <laughs> Hey, General Souls Chicken, we talk about it. Forget There's it. There's no wait. video like that. Get out yeah, of here. Yes, it is. Now y'all bugging. Yes, it is. With the dog and cat. Nigga. Stop it, please. They got the hey, yo, you t- yeah. They said that, that's general for general mice. <laughs> yo, you you tick, you TikTok niggas is fucking up my way of living. I nigga. love them niggas. I hate them. Niggas. I love the TikTok. Stop here. ruining shit. Leave they shit are, alone, nigga. yo. Leave cereal alone. Now we can't eat general souls. Yeah. I mean, you can eat whatever you want, but, but it might did, have I mean, like a long lasting effect what, on but you. But what what did you refer to those people as off mic? Uh, what. What did you say? We heard. Yeah, you we say? were having a conversation. No, we were. Yes, she yes, do this we shit. Were she it. Okay, okay. I, mean, I used the reference that you used, uh, no, but uh, I didn't use it. He didn't yeah, say nothing. But he would have. But he did. He he likes. What to, did you say? He likes to reference uh, the pores. That's what he likes no, what to do. Say? That was what, what I said. Right, so what did you say? Yeah, but tell us the same. I referenced that. You said Kellogg's was. You like eating cereal for dinner is for. That's what. That's what I said. He's going to say that. That's what they're for. Okay, but I didn't say. That was what I said. You never said nothing. That was what I was saying. But that's not what you said. What you said was eating <laughs> cereal for, for dinner, dinner is for the poor. That is not what I said. I said and he, I is that heard Mel he say that. Is going to say that. You guys hear what you want. <laughs> wait, and then, wait, but you then, guys hear what you but want. But then I said, <laughs> you know, dog Mel, piling, you, dog piling, not too oh, much on Mel. Oh. <laughs> What's that break? What the? Yeah, what, yeah, can we start it early? Yeah, when do you leave again? Next week, next Friday. You said. Oh, I don't believe you did that. And then I, Mel is trying to protect her little movie star actress image no, out there. I'm not. No, so I'm then not. I had, take a shot I, at the I had, You're the one with the drops, okay? So I had to remind her that the poors watch movies too. I know. Oh, that's Especially, why she cleaned it up. Again, Especially this, your is, car. this is. Oh. Oh, oh you have been. Oh, 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 Huh? You saying the poor is low, low budget joints? Oh, mm. oh shit. He's doubled down. Wow. Oh shit. He doubled down. Yeah, he is doubling down. Yeah, that's fine. No, up. them the late night joints, no? What's your IMDb <laughs> profile? Oh my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The ones that come on oh, like yeah. three in the morning? <laughs> so on Skinner Max. <laughs> <laughs> that bullshit on three in the morning. Um, <laughs> that shit that come after the Excuse <laughs> me, but my movie is coming on at 8 p.m. Hey. Eastern Standard Time, uh, prime time Saturday, bitch. Big man. Well, 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 that's well, number one. Yeah. Big that, man. Nobody's that's, home. Not, that's number one. Number, two, number what two, is, what does your IMDb profile Woo! say? Thank you very much, sir. Never Thank you. I don't have an IMDb profile. I know. Yeah. Yeah. So you should stop talking. He's busy running around with Rashad and them. Right. He ain't doing what he got to do. I, I, don't, I don't need that. Okay. Oh, you don't need that. Yeah, you tell her, tell what you just shit. said, Ish. Hmm? What? You said you wasn't asking what time to come on in Indonesia. What time to come on in the United States? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I heard you. That's fucked up. Yeah. Ice. He just said that. He didn't say that, yo. <laughs> Ice. <laughs> <laughs> Zombie biker ladies from, from Princeton. <laughs> Hey, no, no, no. hey, yo, what you said, Sad? Oh, shit. Wait, no. Order in the court. Order in the court. Holy shit. Zombie biker lady from Princeton returns to the, the sequel. Part seven. Holy yo, shit. Man, don't be doing shit. Uh, <laughs> Just running around. Run. Yo, you better not fail. If I, if I see you fall in them bushes, I'm, you getting ca- canceled, yo. I'm... Yeah, Why? Why well, can't good, I love can't, a good bush? I can't, I can't <laughs> fall right. in the movie. No. Why? Cause you black. Okay. 
And <laughs> the white side might do it. And the white legs. The white <laughs> bust your ass. Like, oh, it's like man. logic black. Oh, but God. it's in there. It's oh, black in there. This nigga's stupid, yo. Oh my oh, god. Man, Melo, you fool, are gonna break son. the thigh. <laughs> that thigh about to pop. <laughs> oh shit. I ain't gonna hold you. I almost text you the other day. What happened? You're uh you're a stretch dude. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's getting busy. I seen him. He's stretching everybody. Yeah, no. Nah, I seen the one. I said, oh, wait, that? Oh, nah, I salute. seen him with one of my. I was like, all right, all right. You, she told me, I, she said you couldn't get that kink out of back. Oh, she had to go to the room. <laughs> oh, I got to put the headphones on. Yeah. 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 You got to hear how it sounds. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he yeah. ratted. I, I, Sky he Dweller ratted. Is, Sky Dweller is different. Uh, nah, man. <laughs> anyway, I don't mean one of mine like that, silly. I'm uh, just saying, uh, one of mine that. You know, you keep an eye on from a distance. Mm. That nigga was in there stretching her. She put her legs behind her head. She was in there bugging. You talking about Ruby? No. Okay. No. I'll show, I can show you who I'm talking about if you want to see I, it. I, I, saw, I saw that if one. If you want to see it. <laughs> yeah. That's the one I saw. That's the one Ice would yeah, yeah, see, yeah, the yeah. fine 20 year old girl. I looked at the. Hey, nigga. Wait, what? <laughs> Are you hurt? Please fuck your eyes. The one I'm talking fucking. about is something a little different, boy. Oh, yeah. I'll see if I can find and show it to you, but he getting around. I mean, you and, know. and he ain't doing nothing ugly. No, he's he, he ain't doing. He only stretch the baddies. He ain't doing nothing ugly. Oh. so shout out to you. Yeah, I mean, and shout know. out to him. Shout, shout out to, to him. He's, he's that a... might be my new gig. Oh, hey, come get stretched out. <laughs> come stretch some of you bitches. <laughs> Thank you, <every> simply. <laughs> Emotionally Nah the one physically. I seen him with I was like Dog No way You you not hard It's not possible It's impossible I need to see Ain't this. that much professionalism In the Ain't world In the world <laughs> The one I seen him with Nigga, nigga. When I <laughs> He got some distractions He nigga. is a Professional yeah, Dancer He's a man He is a man But I mean like When you're around women And holding their bodies Because you are a dancer That's usually when I get the hardest dancer, Not really Dancers they way of calling somebody gay No No it's not <laughs> That's no, a it's sneak not. tip way of calling I am somebody absolutely, gay Absolutely not He is not Not that there's anything wrong with that But he is not He is a dancer And he's a, he's a professional Salute to him Yeah So he's like He doesn't get easily distracted you know. Does he have headphones in his ears? When he... No. No. Okay. Does he wear like the sock and the tape like the yeah. dude in the movie you were talking about last <laughs> Take a look at that. Okay. Take a gander. Ooh, whoa. Take a gander nice. at that. Nice. Just take wow. a quick little peek at that one right I here. think we he have is. the same one. I, mean, I, I think this is the same one. I'm pretty oh. sure it is. Let me see. Well, she got to show you. No, I, yeah. I wanna, no, no, I'm pretty sure. You can just show me the thing. You don't got to show I'm me just, the I'm, I'm just looking at the video and just, just stretches are just, just so yummy. The They're just so yummy. Feels so good. Oh, oh no! That, oh, yeah. But it's not the same one. Yo, yeah. dude is getting around like Tupac. So <laughs> <laughs> shout out <laughs> to him. Did you say so you you got the page name? That nigga you, went you, to you memorized it. That nigga went no. to Atlanta. That right? There. Oh my! <laughs> Come on, let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move right along. Let's move right along. Yeah. They in a dojo? Oh, my. They in a dojo? <laughs> He's like, Wait, Come on, it's an audio bro. They listen. He said like she can do that. <laughs> Nigga, I almost uh, <laughs> look, 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 look right there. Oh, she's flexible too. Wow, wow, that's impressive. That's that why is impressive. I, see, that's why I don't fuck bitches is five nine and up. I like mine to be able to do a little bit of this here, a couple tricks. <laughs> Y'all five nine holes, move it. Sorry. You well. I know. You're true. Hey, my vibe yeah, is my vibe. No, five they, nine means you're not flexible? No, they get flexy too. I was gonna say. Yeah. I'm not I'm not fucking with them fucking lumberjack <laughs> lumberjack bitches. <laughs> I'm cool. You 5'9", go dunk somewhere. You know, hey, you know who get real flexible? Go play some defense on Caitlin Clark. Who gets real flexible? What the hell is wrong with you? Who? The, the Slimmies. If you 5'9", and there's a 5'5 five five girl standing next to you, guess where I'm going. <laughs> I feel like 5'5 five five is the... Is the five four five, five four five five is nice. Five five. Okay. Yeah. Man, five a million is nice. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Five one to five eleven. I feel you. All right, what if she's yeah, six four taller you than had. you? Six who? What if she's six four and taller than you? I, That's I who we had on the air mattress. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. She was six no, two. She, she, she wasn't six. She was taller than him. She was six one. She's not taller than me. She was taller than him with a no, Caesar. She's not. <laughs> she's not. <laughs> that nigga tossed it up on that air. Let me see you toss it. I was about to do it like, oh, this nigga is a freak ass boy. <laughs> he having fun in there she with this good. fucking power forward. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
this nigga an idiot, yo. I'm mad at him. Oh God. He ain't even. A couple, other, <laughs> a couple other joints on your list. I want to highlight on the Patreon episode later. Yo, what? Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> fuck this guy. Do I want to say that one? Fuck. Yeah, we on your ass. Uh, too. What else? Oprah. Oprah. Uh, she stepped, stepped down. Yeah. Stepped down from Weight Watchers. Yep. That's the billionaire way of saying. We asked you politely to oh, yeah. bust mm-hmm. a move because they found out that Oprah was on Ozempic. Yeah. They actually, and she hasn't actually said it was Ozempic. She said she's been on a diet pill. I'm like, that's, that's, that's a lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Ozempic's not a pill. So that's, there's that. It's Ozempic. Yeah. Um, so she, so she's sharing, um, oh, sorry, she's selling her shares of Weight Watchers. She bought 10% of the company. So she's selling her shares and donating the money. Um, and she's stepping sure, down. Sure, sure. Yeah. Right. yeah. Donate yeah. it. Right. Right. Yeah. Just donate it, right? right. right. Yeah. I was going to give that to y'all. But. Yeah, they said, she said she was donating to, she named the causes. Yeah. Some fly shit, some blackly black shit. Got it. Yeah. It's like African American Museum. Somewhere. Yeah, something true, like that. True. The shit Ish went to. Where you went? Oh, that's the Jay-Z shit. <laughs> <laughs> Ish went to the Jay-Z, Jay-Z shit on the December Alvarez. 4th. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> yeah. This guy is nuts. Um, but what, what is, do y'all but what do y'all think about that? What do y'all what do y'all think about about this news? She's been there since I was a kid. Like, that's one of the longest brand ambassadors ships. No, she bought she bought um her shares in uh 2015. That's when she came on board as like but chair, I think she was endorsing them longer than that, though. Not full, not fully. Like it was just like a, the odd conversation. But when she bought the shares and she became like the chairwoman, that's when she was like doing commercials and just going ham. That's when she went and got Khaled to run on the treadmill for twenty-seven hours a day. Y'all remember that when Khaled when Khaled came along? Uh, I, th- I just think it's rich people business. That's what I think. I think it's Ozembic fucking pharmaceutical business. Yeah, which is rich mm-hmm. people business. Yo, I was telling y'all, I went I went to the doctor the other day and, and just speaking to him, telling him about my weight loss journey, the first thing out of his mouth was, we have, we have something that can help with that. And then I left it alone, but it didn't sit right with me because it brought me back to dope sick yeah, when yep, they was peddling the know. fucking... Yep. Uh, Oxys. Mm-hmm. Oxys and mm-hmm. Percocets and all that shit they was doing brought me back there, but now I can hear it clearly. Did he say Ozempic to you? No. Or did he call it something else? No, he just said, we have something that can help with that. They didn't tell him about it. When I asked, when I Mm. inquired further, Mm -hmm. I said, Ozempic, right? Mm -hmm. He said, yeah. Mm. Uh. So they are suggesting this shit. They are pitching this shit. shit Mm -hmm. It's it's being marketed as a weight weight loss drug now. That is what it's doing. America is a sick place. Bro, it's the best dope out, bro. But think about it, what though. You We're going to give you all the Kellogg's in the world. Yep. <laughs> until you're fucking All the McDonald's, all, all that shit. Milk. We all rank, We tell y'all how obese you are. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and then, then we're going to sell you a drug to fix it overnight, a microwave drug. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of t- promoting better health practices. Right. Yeah. And them doctors, I said, so it's going to shrink your stomach, right? I said, I think I got my stomach. Like, I don't look that overweight, right? Do I? Like, I can handle this. And, and I need my stomach. Thanks. Don't you know this nigga spent five minutes telling me how our stomach is really not needed? <laughs> mm-hmm. Excuse me? He said your stomach is really not needed at all. All your stomach is used for is to di- your to digest, to, to break the food down, mm-hmm. and to store fat. Mm-hmm. But he said all important shit is on the side spleen and everywhere else. So fuck your stomach. <laughs> nigga. Not in those words, of he course. Might, I mean, he could be right. I don't I mean, I'm sure he's right, but who cares, nigga? I, don't think he right. I want my fucking stomach. I, want, I don't think he's right. I want to eat food. No, he is right because I, I know that people with health issues where they take their stomach out. Yeah, they, they can cut half well, of their stomach out. Yeah. No, that's one thing. But I'm saying we were b- made this way for a reason. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like, if, if we didn't need a stomach at all, you gotta protect your shit. Man. Fucking not have one. No, nah, yeah. that's not true. Because human evolution um, is coming along to where shit that we used to need. Like they say, um, oh, never mind. Let's, we can Thanks. move on. Thank you. I'm glad you can hear it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> he was about to go no. crazy. No. I'm with him, though. No. I'm with him. I sound like the uh, the TikTok nigga that's running around saying humans are not supposed to drink water. What? Yes, I do. Y'all didn't see that guy? No, but well, how the fuck I sound like of that? Of course I see. I'm not no, going to play him. He's saying if you get your water from fruits and vegetables, you'll be fine. But you're not supposed to necessarily drink water. Really? He said you're supposed to chew your water. Sounds like an asshole. God damn it. 
Listen, TikTok is going crazy. It really see, is. Hey, see what happens when uh, Lucian, <laughs> Lucian takes the music away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they just start talking about whatever. You got to listen to the stupid now you gotta shit hear this. that motherfuckers are saying. Like, we haven't heard no update about that either, huh? None. What's going to be the update? It's going to come back. I, somebody, somebody, somebody going to cave. Yeah, somebody caving. I thought it would have happened earlier, like three, five days. Mm-hmm. It's a big business. I guess not. Heavyweight business. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But mm. the crazy part oh. about Ozempic is the fact that people who actually need it for like, I don't know, type two diabetes, that it. no, it's yeah. like skyrocketed the price. Yeah, they can't get it. You know, yeah, that, that shit. Ozempic is like, <laughs> that shit is going like It's dope. got everybody, especially it's got Hollywood in a chokehold. You see somebody two weeks ago. You still then tapped you, into Hollywood, ain't you? Huh? Should leave us do Lose weight the old fashioned way, man. <laughs> Go smoke crack. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, y'all know y'all seen niggas in like oh yeah that's yeah, what I thought that's that what, that's that's what, yeah look that's, that's what I thought our man was on nigga he lost weight too fast but he's not his eyes not glossy he look good still <laughs> I thought our man <laughs> that yeah. took a deep turn it's tough to have abs sorry don't smoke crack don't smoke crack don't smoke crack <laughs> do not smoke crack do not smoke crack, not smoke crack. just say no uh, I watched y'all I watched y'all last episode but I didn't see I didn't see y'all talk about murder mook. What happened with Mook? What happened? Flip, tell us. Murder Mook got arrested on his Instagram Live. That's what happened. Uh, police came in and arrested Murder Mook on Instagram Live. I guess he went live to show the police entering his home. Mm-hmm. But apparently his wife called the police on him because him and his daughter had gotten into an altercation. Mm. The police came into the room and arrested Murder Mook, saying that we are arresting you because you scratched your daughter's arm. And now battle rap is making fun of Mook. Uh, they're talking about his living conditions and that's, stuff like that. Right. That's the part right there. I didn't want to get into all of the serious stuff because that is serious We're not gonna make stuff. Jo- you want to make jokes about our man? Yes. <laughs> I can't. Can I turn around? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's your nice effort. That's your turn around. <laughs> not doing that. Listen. We have Tiny Desk. Oh. Come on, Joe. That's your man, we, Joe. You can't do that. That's our man. No. No, Joe. This I, is this is what I checks say, and balances I looks say like right all here. All the time on this podcast. Friends to none of you niggas, right? This is back to our friendship conversation. Sometimes you just don't know how anybody is living. All you know is how they present when they come outside. But while Mook was doing all that hooting and hooting and hollering to them police, begging to get, and Mook, we got to talk, but you was drunk, so I'll give you a pass. He was drunk, I gave him a pass. The size of that bedroom and living room and kitchen and bathroom was like the box that the phone posits came in. How were you able to see each and every room? I zoomed in. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) Dog, I'm coming to each one of y'all homes to check myself. You gonna give us a raise if it's too small? I think everybody had got one. Again, you you gonna give us a raise if it's too small? I think everybody had got one. When? Got one what? A small crib? Got what? A small crib? A raise. Oh. I mean, I watch porn and get a raise. I didn't get a raise up here. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> I watch porn and get a raise. I didn't get a raise up here. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo. Say less. Yo. <laughs> Say less. I, I'll make sure it reflects. Oh, man. <laughs> Say less. What you gonna do? Take the nut out the check? What the fuck are you talking oh, about? Oh, get that nigga in! Sure oh, look, now there's a nut in the check. <laughs> <laughs> look how fast we found the raise. Yo. Yo, Mook, you have to move. Mm. I love you. You Damn. know don't nobody love you more than me now. That's a fact. <laughs> you have to move now. You cannot get on another fucking stage. Going crazy on nobody. Saying a peep. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, that bathroom. See, that's the thing about battle rap. You bro. almost got to piss from outside the bathroom in that shit. You got to try to aim right, and hit man, the stop. toilet. Enough. You got to have the dope dick aim. <laughs> That nigga had the nerve to have a shoebox collection. <laughs> hey, nigga, ain't no room to collect. Be a collector of a fucking thing in here. <laughs> nigga, you can't collect sta- staples. You can't collect comic books. You can't collect loose leaf. <laughs> he had the nerve to have mad kicks. You guys are hilarious. 
Don't say you guys are laughing. We're not laughing. You it's, laughing. It's just eyes are watering, okay? Mook. <laughs> it's ain't laughing. Mook. Mook. Move. Hmm? Yeah, you peel it right there. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, you pull. Um, in white people's yeah. news, uh, Ruth Goddesman has donated a billion dollars to Albert Einstein College of Medicine. Wait, what? Which would what leave. What the fuck yo, are you yo, talking yo, about? Yo. Which would leave. Yo, hey, big dog. Hey, big dog. <laughs> which would leave. I'm back. <laughs> no, I'm back. Which would leave the students there at Albert Einstein Med- College of Medicine Debt tuition free. free. Tuition free and tuition free what? moving forward. Shout out to Ruth, the humanitarian. We love you. <laughs> don't do that again. <laughs> That's white people do. But don't do that ever. So you want to make fun of our black that. brother, yes. and his, but you don't want to big up Ruth and her philanthropy work. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, if y'all are listening to this audio, you got to go watch the video. And look at Joe's hey, face. I, he said, fuck Ruth. Hey, <laughs> he I, to, I told Paul and all them camera niggas, oh, the shit. second Candace Owens start talking about build the wall to get me off of the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, and she was dead ass, wouldn't change the subject. <laughs> <laughs> hey, she got that political posture face. So you try to sit there with a straight face, but you can't because some of that shit's funny. <laughs> Something. <laughs> Yo, you an idiot. Yeah. I went so Drew and all them niggas. Hey, when she do that, hey, get me off, get me off the screen. Anyway, shout out to Roof. <laughs> <laughs> Mook. Oh, you go back to the black brother. <clears throat> Just go, yo. Just go. Just go. That's Do you why feel that like shit tricky, trying. man? And it's tough now. They start doing, hey, once they throw it at first and last and the security. Oh, God. Realtor fee. Realtor fee. In New York, it costs you 20 grand to move. That shit get expensive. It costs you 20 grand to move in New York. What? True. Don't yeah. give it away for free. Yeah, Save that hour. He might be. <laughs> 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 You can use that. <laughs> hey, don't give it away for free, nigga. It's we not, uh, we hustling. It's not for. <laughs> why do you think people are, people are making fun of him? Why? Because he's he's murder mook and still you know he might he might be in a fixed joint. He might be comfortable where he at. He might you know. Well, I'm, I don't find it funny, nigga. We I don't. Wish. We didn't imagine mook to be uh, in the NYCHA. We heard his brother. His, we heard his brother come out making fun of Mook to my nigga. I, my I brother don't like Mook. He's to Florida. I got a house, three bedrooms, four bedrooms, cars, and all that. And and, and it just you know what it says. Salute, nigga. Everybody different. Mook make too Probably. much money to to be there. So we assume allegedly. So we assume. But maybe your money go to other things that we should speak to a bigger cause instead of making fun of our brother. But I'm not I mad at that. Just don't collect sneakers. <laughs> I can see what that fight was about. <laughs> if I'm the girlfriend, shit. Are you? Nigga, are you? you got a fucking sneaker collection. <laughs> no, I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> All in fun. That's right. Fun. All in fun. Hold your man down. There you go. I hope. Hold your man down. Hey, Stand free, in solidarity free, with free, your man. Free mook till it's backwards. Yeah. Three, you, three him. <laughs> Three, three Mook. <laughs> Wait, three M. No, I hate Drake. <laughs> Drake needs to shut the fuck up. Three Tory. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, Y'all coming down, so I ain't gotta get that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, what else? Real quick, I'll touch on I'll touch on my thoughts of the Wendy Williams uh okay. here we go. two two part doc. I've seen it forty five times. Uh again, I'm praying for Wendy. I don't think anybody deserves to go through some of that that she's going through. Uh, and my take is not that long and drawn out. I think that that publicist and the manager need to be arrested immediately. Mm-hmm. I think there needs mm-hmm. to be a citizen's arrest made for what is going on with them two. Well, the most recent ups- update is that they are no longer in her employ. Like, both gone. I'm sure. Good. Yeah. Oh, shit. Clap it up. Yeah. Clap it up for the... Oh, they won't clap. <laughs> they will not clap. Why well, y'all won't even clap it? <laughs> he can't clap. I don't. I don't necessarily like, know if I agree with that. Bit. No, but uh, he, he, puts, he, he brought, I don't really know if I agree with that. He brought me the wrong way when I watched it too. Is he did? I, I said that. Yeah, you did. But, he did to get arrested. Both of them. But no. But now when you have a job and you're doing a job, and um, we don't necessarily know, and I'm not caping. We don't necessarily know under what conditions they were working with somebody that may be. Um, I do. I do. And look, they showed him reporting to the guardianship. You ain't. 
I didn't finish. I didn't see the oh, last yeah, you gotta watch it. Like, no, oh, I know I said I didn't, no, finish. didn't finish. I'm talking saying. about, oh. yo, when you w- working with somebody that may be not in the best mental state, like one day they saying one thing, one day they saying another thing. One day they firing you, the next day they calling you to come back. Like it's a it's it's a tricky situation, and we saw that with some of the stuff. She was cursing the nail lady out. You okay. get what I'm saying? And then hold up, let me finish. You curse the nail lady out on Monday, then you call in the next week, like yo, you late for your appointment. No, I quit. You get what I'm saying? So it's a touchy situation when you're dealing with stuff like that. So we don't know if they were trying to uh, appease her for a check. It looks like. Mm-hmm. You speaking for you. I am speaking for what I saw, and they are trying to appease her for a check, which is why they need to be arrested. It didn't take more than five minutes for anybody to look at Wendy Williams and say, oh, she shouldn't be broadcast nowhere. I agree with that. You don't need to have a podcast, a nodcast. I said that. Nothing. I said that, too. You don't need to have a television show. Yeah, but, th- but Wendy, who I saw your take about her mm-hmm. being addicted to fame, and I agree with that. So if you have somebody that you see is addicted to fame, mm-hmm. she's just saying, I got all the money in the world. Mm-hmm. And I believe her if she get to her money, but you don't. But she ain't doing it for the money. She's doing it for the fame. Mm-hmm. Cool. If your handlers now are looking at you in that condition and still trying to get you in front of public eyes, they are not in your best interest. That's if, you're, you. if your handlers are doing all that and keeping you from your family or all the people that are not being paid or all the people that just have a different plan to get our health back in order, then they should not be in the picture. I don't care that homeboy was running around hiding some liquor bottles. You're trying to get her seen. I agree with that. Look at her. Look at how she spoke to the nail lady. Look at how she spoke to this person. Mm-hmm. She could barely walk up the fucking street. Mm-hmm. Anybody that's trying to get Wendy Williams to look after what we saw, you need to go to jail. Or you just have a different agenda at play. There it is. Yeah, but that's the fucking problem I'm, dis- I'm highlighting. Look, I'm not disagreeing with that. Wendy is big coin, big ticket. The guardianship is appointed from the bank. The guardianship is now picking a team to surround Wendy, and they are in direct odds with the fucking with the family or the people mm-hmm. that love her. The son couldn't even talk to that nigga when uh when he came to the uh, restaurant table when it was forty five minutes late, trying to dap him up. Nigga, move. The fucking the the, the aunt. What was that? The not the aunt. The, the, uh, the younger. The, 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 oh, the, uh, the niece. The, the niece. Mm-hmm. The niece when she was over there, and, and I'm glad she did it. Uh, cause when the other girl came in there and tried to sit in there, bitch, why are you sitting here? I'm with my family. They already taping the show. Can I get an hour or two hours with my fucking family member without y'all pariahs roaming around? Move the fuck out of the way. I don't see how anybody that saw that couldn't have, couldn't have walked away with that. Just that part, I agree at least. With that. I agree with everything you're saying. I'm, but your agenda point has val- validity so, and merit. I got a job to do. She telling me what to do. I'm doing what she telling me to do. Who's she? Wendy. But Bro, no, you, you, you're not doing what Wendy's telling you to do. You're doing not. what the guardianship is telling you to do. And Wendy's not in her right mind. Them, peop, them people I, was working for the guardianship, yeah, point. reporting no. to the guardianship, uh, telling them what's going on. Oh, shit, she's in L.A. I'm scared. I, yo, I'm so scared. I got to report this to the guardian now because they're going to react the same way I'm going to react. She's not supposed to be out there. Nigga! No. Guess, All of that shit guess, is fact. Guess why? Guess why what? Guess why they doing it? Tell, it. tell us. Because the guardianship cuts the checks. Is you confused? We're saying the same. Thing. I'm saying that everybody's agenda. I'm agreeing with you, but everybody's agenda ain't the same. If somebody's giving me a job to do, and I might feel differently, I might let me. If I came in here and said, "Joe, I don't think you should do that," and you say, "No, fuck that, I want to do that," uh, what I'm gonna say? It seemed really. Ish, it it also seemed I'm really, really say, okay. Can I ask you a question? It's just very different if Yo, I can't walk up the street. I'm just giving. You ish, let me ask you a question, bro. You a nigga that stand for something? Mm-hmm. You're co not co signer but you you. you Giving this man runway, a nigga that's pushing him. I'm, a, a, I'm a, saying a, I understand. It seemed like a nigga that's pushing a woman that's not mentally there. If you care about her, you would want to worry about her health first. You're pushing her in front of the camera, and she's not all there in order to collect the check, nigga. That's I nasty. Got, agree. That's and nasty. He, he, he deserves to be fired, and that's it. I'm saying agree. Yeah, but you say but that you he, agree, had, he had to do a job I'm, and I'm, he had to... Yo, we up like, here giving a podcast and I'm showing you the objective side of that. Where is this man may not necessarily have her best interest at heart, but he has a job to do. And again, I gave you an example. When she sat on the steps with him and said, yo, I want to get back on TV. She said that. I saw and that. he said, all right, we could do that. Yeah, but he, only, he only doing it for a check. Wrong. Though, he don't do it because he care for her. Foul. I agree. Flagrant. 
All of that I'm is I'm not bad. saying what he was doing was correct. Are I'm you not... trying to say that in that moment was the appeasement? Yes. Okay. A so thousand he, so percent. He's basically lying Yo, fam, her, what, what I'm saying, saying is this. Under her behavioral outburst, under her um, her highs and lows, right? Mm -hmm. She wouldn't have no employees. Ish. Wendy Williams don't need employees. That's right not now. true. When you are physically incapable of doing anything. Wendy Williams does not need employees right now, especially ones that she cannot hire and vet herself. She don't need people. She don't need all of that, all of that glitz and glam, I, I, all, I, that, all that Mariah Diva camp mm -hmm. shit. Mm -hmm. She need to go be in a facility somewhere, mm -hmm. in, in, a, in a, a, well, with her family somewhere. It's time for the people that love you and are not oh. paid by you to try to nurse you back to health. It seems like that's a where she is now. A million percent agreed with you. She don't want that. You didn't get that from the movie. Because what, the niggas yes, is encouraging her not to go that direction. That's not no, true. No, because even in the beginning, she did when not she was down want there, that. When she she went, went to Florida with her family. She wanted to leave. Because they wouldn't allow her to They wouldn't allow her to do the fuckery, wanted. so she wanted to I'm leave. I'm not trying to have a debate with y'all. No, crazy. I'm saying. Whatever Wendy Williams want don't matter in my story. Because she's not in the right mind. What she want has no bearing on what I'm saying. Her mm -hmm. days are over for that now. It's time for someone else to make the decisions, and that's what they're having to fight about. Yeah. Yes. The family wants to do it I'm versus the guardianship, and we're having, there's a power struggle here that Wendy yeah. is in the middle of, unfortunately, and she shouldn't be because she's the only one suffering. Mm -hmm. And that suffering, if you're looking at it, that was tough to watch, even though I watched it. it well, I couldn't. Yeah. I couldn't watch it. It was, it was rough. Night. I could only it watch the first night. I could not do it. It was rough. She went back to her 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 hometown, her block. I yeah. heard y'all talk yeah. about yeah. it. Well, she went back to the block, it. trying to receive the love. She trying to tell somebody that grew up in the neighborhood where she lived, and she wrong. She, she don't remember know. where she lived. She didn't even know. She didn't know. She's like, no, I live there. And then she, she asked the lady him. is telling her, no, no, sweetie, you live down there. That's why this block is named after you. You live up there. I saw you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was there. You can't. Mm -hmm. Like, dog, it's, she don't need to talk to nobody. Even when she went to L.A. and the fans was like, how you doing? Da, 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 da. That L.A. trip should never have happened. She was practically, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to use the word kidnapped, but she was. She went, she wasn't supposed to go. She went with that publicist chick, Sean, and nobody knew. But like, wait. That was the disaster. That was a, the biggest disaster because she ended up in front of the big wigs at NBC. Mistake. That was a massive mistake. Now, I'm not going to say that she shouldn't have went to L.A. <laughs> because... That was the only reason why she was going to L.A. was to present her... present herself as a concept for, you know, her li comeback. Listen to me, y'all. I don't care about what Wendy Williams says her agenda is. So I know what she thought she was going to L.A. for. But Sean fulfilling that agenda w was what was wrong. Can I talk? Sorry, go ahead. Y'all covered this without me, right? Sorry, go ahead. Can y'all shut the fuck up for a minute okay, and just let me talk? She called the girl and said, I'm starving and there's no food in the fridge. I've been trapped in this house, hungry. Nobody has grocery shopped. I'm losing my mind. Take me. That's what she said. That show shit was, yeah, she want to go do the show. Cool. But she trapped in a house and none of the handlers that's being paid even put a honey bun in the fridge. Yes, you're going to call somebody. I thought in that moment, the girl should have came over there and did something with Wendy. And now that's where her and, the, her and dude's beef is. But I don't think dude had a leg to stand on. Because if you want her to stay in this house... And, and go by your orders, the nigga, the least you could do is put some fucking food Agreed. in the fridge so she could eat something. That whole shit was a mess. Wendy, I love you. She's crazy. The publicist girl is on online still now just against everything that was shown in the dog. Oh, it was framed a certain way. She's saying everything to make you forget that this bitch is a publicist. Mm. Mm. Talk your She's shit, She's a publicist being shown this way on a main 8 o'clock lifetime mm. broadcast. You'll never work again. Mm. You won't publish this again nowhere. Them niggas is nuts. And then to find out that the nigga wasn't even a manager, he was a jeweler. Mel Yo, stop fucking playing with me in here. What are y'all talking about? You don't even have competent people on top of this. Every time he pop up, he got a new chain. Oh, well, Wendy. 
Man, stop, yo. Stop this. He annoyed me, too. Stop this. He annoyed me. Stop this. Put somebody by my side that could be by my side. Don't go get no fucking rinky-dink jeweler that's just happy he's being paid from this guardianship and call it having my best interest. That was a fucking mess. I love you, Wendy. That's what I got. Y'all made me sound like Ice with the Jeezy shit. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, but you wasn't mad at Wendy. It's different. You know, I wasn't mad at Wendy. I'm mad at you. Can't be. I can't be. I, exactly. I, I, I no, I'm saying that's, it's just different. I, I couldn't be. What you dealing with? With a feet? Absolutely. That eye condition that make her eyes bulge yeah, and, pop. And, and pop out. The doctor's appointments that she got to take from the Supreme Court. <laughs> Not even for my health, but just because the Supreme Court is sending me to two and three different doctors over here. Too, that's a lot. Yes. That was a lot. A lot. A lot. Mm. I just ain't like, I, I said it before, I, I just didn't like... Um, AMC saying, had we known this, we would have never recorded any of this. And A&E. All shit. A&E. All yeah. shit was for a bad. I, yeah, I, I, that was disgusting to me. Because even if you didn't know it, you saw it. So, so, so fuck off. I wasn't mad at them. Jo- Joe, uh, courts am. appoint guardianship when you don't have wills and stuff in, or like. Mm-hmm. She had a, her, she gave her son power of attorney. So when do they, so. The bank was alerted. And they took it because they felt like uh, it was too much too much excessive spending. Yes, the so bank was alerted bucks, to her. You spent a buck fifty on a party. They said he spent over a hundred grand on Uber Eats. Mm-hmm. Uh, he spent eighty grand on some other shit. And their right. explanation in the in the doc was Wendy likes lavish shit and they have lived a lavish lifestyle for a while. So some of these things you're reading like eighty grand in rent. Yeah, that sounds crazy unless you're talking about somebody who It's not crazy. It's yeah, a, but even we in a bubble. So I mean, to the people watching, no, mm-hmm. we are. We in a bubble. Um, a hundred grand on Uber Eats is crazy. Yeah, eighty mm-hmm. grand on rent is not crazy. It's two totally different things to me. Like if you living in Miami, you in a high rise, and my family's rich. It's motherfuckers in New York that spend forty five thousand dollars a month in rent. Mm-hmm. I didn't and, think the buck fifty on a birthday party was crazy either. But I'm just highlighting. Hundred grand on Uber Eats and how long? They what? didn't say. That's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. That, that, that might not be crazy either. Yeah, they didn't say. I disagree. You order, you Uber you order from, from the some house. steakhouse or some shit, and you have it brought to you. My nigga, if you, you spend a hundred grand on Uber Eats in six months, I think that's crazy. What if you do it in a year? Okay, but Still my thing is even that. If I have five million in the bank, mm-hmm. I want to be able to blow five million. That's my five million. It's not your five million. It's your mother's five million. And then when you got her, I get it, she wasn't in her right mind, but when you have her saying, it's your mother's five million. Him. It's your mother's five million. And um, Kevin was, what, 19? So you're 19, you got, God willing, another 60 years ahead of you. So now if you just out here going crazy in four or five years, money goes away fast, fam. That's a fact. It's a lot of okay. athletes that had money. We see them every fucking day that That's ran true. through 100 million, ran mm-hmm. through 50 million, ran through whatever mm-hmm. the case may be. Mm-hmm. Somebody now has to step in and, 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 and protect your mother's money. I don't think it's a, a bad thing to do that, especially when 19-year-olds are frivolous. He may have and never had a job. From himself. And he, he's accustomed to a I, certain lifestyle. I mm-hmm. would agree with you if... Wendy hasn't been adamant this entire time with there's nothing funny about my accounts and I would like to access my money. My son has power of attorney. Everything that happened, I approve of. If she never said that, then I'm with you. Cool. Stay stay here. I just want to give you some pushback. Now, all of those things happen. Would you agree or disagree that Wendy is not of sound mind? Yes. You would agree. So making that agree. so making so that, that statement, statement. So now my that's kind of nullifies I, the statement, right? There you go. No, yes, because that's why I gave myself the power of attorney. Listen to this. But I'm you, not of sound mind. You can't I, stop. You can't legally give somebody power of attorney when you're not of sound mind. That's a fact. It is nullified in a court of law. Mm-hmm. Granted, I say then the court of law needs to pick a different family member. To be, but what happens when your family members are beefing and they can't pick one? Everybody. Wants that's where a different. guardianship that's, slash conservative. That's why they went the guardianship comes route. In. They said that in the beginning. You can't if this if they're at odds. We don't know them, so if y'all can't agree on nothing. We can't trust none of y'all to have her best interest. And then the relationship I, between the family so and the guardianship get, becomes acrimonious. So they're all like kind of at a, at a standstill. I hear that, mm-hmm. but I don't necessarily believe that. Like, I saw Wendy, well, and this is all from TV, so Mm -hmm. take it with a grain of salt. But I saw family members fighting to get with her and get her right. I saw a dad 
I saw sisters, but mm-hmm. I've seen I've seen family members that look like good upstanding black people. <clears throat> and Wendy father mm-hmm. Wendy father don't he ain't broke. And he, and he seems to she be come, of sound mind. She come mm-hmm. from a little bit of money. Like I remember my, my man um went to Monmouth. My man went to Monmouth and he uh her father Alpha. He in the fraternity in Alpha. They used to go over and cross sands at their father crib. Like he had a nice size crib back and this is in that fucking 90s, early 90s, eight, like you know what I'm saying? So she don't come from, she ain't come from no bum ass family. That's the one question I walked away with, right? Like when I was seeing the dad, and we can move on from this because it was overdone. But looking at the dad, I'm like, yo, it seemed like the dad could just squash all of this. But then my girl was like, dog, if Wendy is however old, then how old is the dad? Who you even know that the dad want to wanna go through any That's a of good this point. shit. Well, but the dad, the dad could step in as power of attorney and then kind of put things into place because he's the kind of, for lack of a better phrase, the overseer of the family. Like yes. he sees. Hopefully. Yeah, he yeah. probably has a better understand, like a good, good understanding of the inter, you know, like the interpersonal relationships and who would be best suited. I think that the son as having power of attorney and the lack of knowledge as it relates to financial, um, you know. Wellness. It, it, well, yeah, like, it, exactly. Mm-hmm. He's not the best choice. He just wasn't. Mm-hmm. I agree. Love you, Wendy. Thoughts yeah. and prayers. Yeah. Yeah. Love that's you, it. Wendy. Thoughts and prayers. And that's that. That's that on that. What, yeah. what else we got that's important? Or unimportant? I don't care. Um, well, the, the two dudes that were on trial for the murder of Jam Master J were found guilty. Yeah. So, Great. Rest in peace, Jam Master Rest in peace, Jam Master J. It was his stepson, right? And, and family yeah, friend. No, not yeah, stepson, yeah. it was his godson. Godson. Godson and family friend. Round of applause for them being found guilty. Great. Um, I said Big Me just coming home. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, round of applause. Yeah, round of applause. I'm sorry. Round Don't of applause talking. for that. Come Meech. on. Meech. Yeah, Meech is, um, they reduced the sentence. I think it was supposed to be like 2028 20, or something, but mm-hmm. now it's early next, well, sometime next year, 2025. Nice. So, that's good. He's coming okay. home, man. He 50 got him. I think he's going to be good. And BMF season three just started, just dropped yesterday. I haven't Two seen it yet. Seen and I, we, I watched we it, won't but spoil I, it yeah, for you guys. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I just, just watch yeah, it. You know, I used to come spoil some shit. No, no. I don't. <laughs> you guys didn't see it. It came out an hour ago. Nah, <laughs> Why don't you put your phone down and get off Twitter? Yeah, well. <laughs> I'm tweeting if I see it. I gave you 30 minutes. <laughs> That's ice bag right no, there. BMF is one of uh, 50, 50 struck gold with the BMF thing. Like, I, I, I like it. I think most of the reviews are good, so I can't wait to see it. Yeah, same. Same. Um, y'all want to tell me about uh, what happened when you called a stud big fella? <laughs> Wait, what? I forget it. Then. <laughs> tell us what happened. You Joe. tell us what happened. Yeah, yeah. What happened? I asked y'all something. I never done it. No disrespect. Have you done that? Better. I've done it before. And what happened? And what happened? I was corrected. Physically. <laughs> <laughs> what did what did what did the person right, say? All right. Uh, I don't know. It cursed me the fuck out, but I never did it again. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> all right, so tell me about when you congratulated the pregnant chick that wasn't pregnant. Oh, oh I've done that. Oh, I've done that. I've uh, done that. That wasn't. Yeah, it's bad. That didn't go nice. I did that before. I'll try to get around my good potting ways. I got a backup question. <laughs> got a backup that went, that went actually bad, actually. Um, I got pulled in the office at work. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Her harassment. They ended up, like, they, they were all that shit. Yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, did she get suspended? No. Nah, over, nah. over a mistake? I that don't matter. Was, yeah, it don't matter. You commented on her weight. Yeah, that don't matter. You well, commented on her weight. Congratulations, because I thought you were. You can't do that. You can't. Yeah, you can't do that. You cannot do that, bro. Even if you're wrong, you can't do that. Oh, yeah. you never had the lesson. Nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's yeah, when you yeah. find out in real yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Yep. he didn't. He yeah. just didn't have the lesson. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Good for you. That stomach must have been crazy, huh? It was. That shit was crazy. It's like, oh shit, I didn't even know. Yo, congratulations. She's like, oh, you about to pop? She gave me the oven. I'm not pregnant. So yeah. Too much cereal. If you go through that. 
<laughs> fucking Kellogg's, yo. <laughs> fucking Kellogg's, yo. I call myself being cordial, being nice, you know what I mean? Yo. Oh, shit. Mind my business, yeah. man. If you go through that once, you'll never do it no again. No word. Mm -hmm. that's, I don't that's... care how big the bitch is. <laughs> you ain't going to say, oh, how many months? Nope. And you'd be nothing. fucked up because now sometimes like they actually are pregnant. And nope. You feel like a dick. You're like, uh, I'm nope. not doing yeah, nah. it again. No. I, I let it. You mind your business. Sorry. Uh -huh. You wait till the baby in their arms and say, yep. "Congratulations." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope. Yep. That's crazy. Still don't. Son. Might not be. Mm -mm. No. Mind your business. That's it. Um, we do have a part of the show. Again, if you are not subscribed to our Patreon, please subscribe now. Mm -hmm. Nothing but good times and vibes over there. Uh, and this question is from someone named Curtis Approved. What's up, Kurt? What's up, Kurt? Curtis Approved says, Hello, gang. This question is inspired by Mel. <coughs> we all see Mel's transformation this last month as she has been in her pod bag. Hence Thanks. her being named Potter of the Month for February. Oh, Salute. shit. Hey. Who the f I'd name, I'd do that. I oh. Who the fuck is he? <laughs> What are you talking about? <laughs> it's on Twitter. No, Parks. There's a whole it's bingo you, card. But it's not you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Meanie. <laughs> Damn, you ready to fuck it up? All right, uh, We can't help but notice your recent energy and change in demeanor has been linked to the mention of Collins. Collins <laughs> has seemed to bring the Mel out of her shell. <laughs> Question for the fellas. Can you remember a time when a relationship brought the best out of you or made you feel like your best self? Or can you remember a time where a relationship did the opposite and sucked the energy out of you and made you uh, made you feel not like your best self? Mm -hmm. Easy answer for me. Uh, my baby currently, oh man, love her so much. Shout Sucker. out to her. Uh, brings the best out of me. Makes me feel like the amazing man I know God intended me to be, created in his likeness. Uh, so grateful the blessings uh, come abundantly. And I, hey, Park, I, sugar. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> what you talking about, yo? Yeah, yeah, I got married. That's kind of the same, but he's going to say way more poetic to me. So. Yeah. yeah. Well, and you cut me off. I was about to get to all the ain't shit bitches I was <laughs> sticking my dick in that was fucking sucking the life sucking out of me. Sucking the life out of you. Suck you fucking, fucking day not, walkers. Yeah, not yeah. making me fucking aspirational, not spiritual. Bitches wasn't saging. <laughs> Talk about it. I wasn't praying for you. Yeah, stupid ass fucking Susan. Hey, man, bitches. mine is called the missing piece for a reason. That's all I got to say them. on that. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, that man. Stupid shit. ass nigga. Putting called money in the Susu. Susu bitches. That's all they want to do. Oh, they suck the life out of you and start a Susu. <laughs> <laughs> And when it's daytime to hit, they get missing. Yo, the funny part is, <laughs> of course you do. Hey, yo, you're an idiot. That bitch yo. sucked the whole life out of me. <laughs> she did. Oh, man, this nigga is a fool, <laughs> son. <clears throat> Anyone, anyone else? I answered. Oh, married. no, no, no. I've been married too long. Oh. It's his turn. I mean, my current girl is all of those things for me. Like, cool, right? Times 10. Um, so but, you can say it, but I can't. No, because you start, you start times getting 10. into your mm. poetic yeah. Times back. 10, though. Times Ooh. infinity. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Only yeah, 10? Is two plus infinity, two equals nigga. forever? Yo. Oh, yeah. Oh, what? I've had only a few that I've been unfortunate enough to let suck me. Pause. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Suck your what? Suck wow. the doors out there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fucked up. Man. Big vacuum. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fucked up, yo. Oh man. Uh, hopefully we were able to answer that question. And big up to Mel. Big Mel. Big, big call. Shout out to y'all. Ah. I clap for you, Mel. What's yeah, up, Mel. Ah. Uh. Listen, my brother, TikTokers. I'm tired of TikTokers, they man. They fucked up Pop Tarts for me and all that shit, man. I'm tired of that shit, bro. <laughs> Wait, what's the fuck? That Pop Tarts shit fucked me up. You can't fuck with Pop Tarts now? No, man. What? They said that shit is bad. <laughs> oh, man, everything bad. I thought you were like, oh, no, no, wait, man. Pop, -tarts, Pop -tarts, so, Tarts is bad, I, Ice. I follow this little quirky white boy podcast. Yeah, I mean, all that shit. That uh, they just ask really quirky questions and make the other nigga try to guess it. Mm -hmm. And he was like, top 10 American snacks that are bad for you. Oh, I saw that one. You saw it? Mm-hmm. Nigga, Pop Tarts was high. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You ain't all right. Two Cheetos was on the list. Quite Pudding. The, the hot Cheetos. <laughs> the hot Cheetos. And the other Cheetos. Both of them shits was on there. Takis on there? Don't make me go find. I won't. We, we had a good Takis. day. We had a good day. Man. That's what <laughs> you be doing. You be researching these things. You be to get out of the game. Huh? <laughs> you, keep, you keep your eye on everything, huh? <laughs> Niggas gonna fix you up, too. <laughs> what are you talking about? 
Nico came and said, yo, daddy, I, I watched Kasha and that and Aiden Ross go at Joe. I said, like, get the fuck away from me, Nico. <laughs> <laughs> so look, now Joe with the kids now. Yeah, Joe. And, and niggas gonna go 50-50 ha- on you and buy you. <laughs> Damn, I ain't heard That's this you. in a minute. Oh, I know what this means. I'm not for sale. I'm not for sale. Morals not for sale, ish. <laughs> Morals not for sale. Damn. Okay, Joe yeah, son. Nigga. Joe son. Uh, yeah, it's him still. I'm going to cut this off because I'm going crazy and I want to end this shit. <laughs> I'm going to play it. I don't want to talk over it. Yo, we killed this shit. I want to thank y'all for being as loose as y'all were when I was gone. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully y'all were as comfortable. Hopefully this was a fun environment, just as much fun <laughs> as it was when I was gone. Hopefully we laughed and said no. Mm-hmm. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> no. Damn. We had to let you get your shit. We had to, you know what it is? We're a team player, so we had to let you get your shit off. You just got back. I think Tuesday when we come back, I think it's going we, we let you get your shit off, man. You wasn't here for a while. You missed a lot. We saw you, uh, you know, saliva, like saliva dripping from your mouth like a dog with rabies. So we just let you get ahead, man. Go ahead, Fido. Run around. Get your shit off. Come. And then, you know. We sat here like your owners and just watch you Fido. <laughs> run in the grass. Owners. <laughs> owners. Mm. Wow. You know what the dog running in the grass in a circle for man? But you, you back. We ain't say none of that shit leading up to December. <laughs> 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 it was a whole different vibe. That's what I mean. Like, like, no, 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 no. We don't. Listen, keep us in your prayers. Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Until the next time. We bid you adieu, farewell, adios, arriba, dirt. Oh, I smoked that lot. Over, why not? Uh, <laughs> uh, we bid you adieu, farewell, adios, arriba, dirt, hasta la vista, au revoir. Remember, life is a series of moments and moments past, so let's make this moment last as if it's all we have. What y'all doing this weekend? Anything? Out. Family shit. Side. I'm going to Houston for the rodeo. Huh? Okay. I'm going to Houston for the rodeo. Okay. Alone? Huh? Alone? I'm huh? getting on a it's plane. Fine. I'm it's getting fine. on a plane alone. We got it, girl. We got it. Uh, I'm with Ice. I'm Ow. the outsideiest. For sure. I'm not How's the weather this weekend, guys? I don't care. I'm the outsideiest of outside. Baby girl this weekend. No. Got I it. think about going to New Orleans tomorrow, but I don't, I don't, I don't oh, know. Shit. Oh, shit. You just got money like that. Just New Orleans flight is kind of expensive. What's popping no, it's in not. New it's not Orleans? Bad. My brother's event is um, out there. Oh, work. Uh, uh, uh. So they some things moved around. So. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Buddy pass? I wish. Yeah, oh. you need a hoodie to go down there with? I got you. <laughs> mm. Bring that to you today. Mm. Mm. Oh, you go to his house. Oh, shit. You delivering the niggas' cribs. <laughs> this is why niggas feel away, nigga. Did Moog I- ever have company? <laughs> <laughs> Like, did he ever host the kickback? Like, did Lux ever come over and, like, write rhymes together? <laughs> That's why that nigga was undefeated for, like, 15 rounds right in that room. Now, you can't lose. You're right in there. You're right in the dungeon, nigga. <laughs> You're right in the depths of hell. <laughs> oh, that nigga, boy. was like, how the fuck did he beat him? Oh. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> We hope y'all have enjoyed this podcast. We'll be back same time, same place next week, man. You know the vibes. Gang, gang, gang. Hold it down. Everybody have a good weekend, man. Let's try to get back safe and sound. What happened? Can I ask you a question? No, this is the end. Okay. This ends with... My fault, my brother. Go ahead, now. So I don't fuck with you, Z. Go ahead, now. So I don't fuck with you. No, ain't no go ahead. Don't do shit, nigga. Don't do... No, I'm ending this. You didn't get to end the last podcast? I did. And started, right? I did. What what makes you the A mic when I'm not here? I'm just here to entertain. And What'd you say, Mel? Huh? What'd you say? I mean... <laughs> What'd you say? We just... We sat in our normal seats. Man, everybody's scared there. to say what makes Flip the A mic is because Flip took that spot. Flip wants that shit and he did his fucking job as the A mic. We were all happy with him being the A mic when you're not here. I think I can speak for the rest of the gang. We like that shit. You did your fucking job. Don't let nobody try to shit, shit on you over that. Let's go, Freeze. Don't say it again. <laughs> Thank you, Ice. I appreciate that. <laughs> Fuck that. I ain't want it. Did you want it? Did you want it? I'm, I'm just here for Did you want it? For the team. All right, then. Damn. I got... You ain't asked mail? I, got I did. I got schooled. No, I'm just yeah. saying. I got... I went like this. That was a read. It wasn't a read. You wanted it? I felt red. It's okay. Now you want to ask her last. I asked her. I said, did you want it? Did you want it? Did you want it? Big dog? 
Let me end this. <laughs> you got a little jingle for us or something, man? Yeah, let me, let me. Shut the fuck up. How about that? How about that for a second? Now. This nigga is nasty. Disgusting. No hate, no drop for you. Bad hate. Bad hate. That's crazy. Come on, these niggas. Who the fuck is here? What the fuck is wrong with him? Shut the fuck up, nigga. Shut the fuck up. Talk to me like that. Hell yeah, nigga. I got you, bro. JBP, JBP. Where would you be without the JBP? No, Joe Biden.